Vale, pues hola y bienvenidos fans de Levia Games. Soy director de esta aquí en The Stanley Parable, edición ultra de luz. ¿Le puedo dar aquí? No, ¿verdad? <ríe> no me deja. Y esto no tiene nada. Bueno, Stanley Parable es un juego que salió hace bastantes años. Es un clásico, en realidad. Tiene, tiene años, ¿no? Más de cinco seguro, porque, porque la gente se ha sacado el logro de estar cinco años sin jugar. No sé en qué año salió. Pero bueno, esa la versión Ultra Deluxe. En su momento nunca jugué a Stanley Parable. Me lo compré, pero nunca lo jugué. Me vi algún vídeo, pero nunca me vi ni todos los finales, ni, ni, ni todo. Entonces, ya era hora de, de darle a Stanley Parable. Eh, me falta el chat, perdón. Me falta el chat, por si acaso hay alguien. Así que nada, vamos a darle a Stanley Parable. Ultra Deluxe, vamos a intentar hacer todo finales que sea y si no hoy, pues otro día Así que bueno, es un juego que juega con todo, ¿no? O sea, el típico que rompe la cuarta pared y, y todo Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number four. No, pues es más genérica la Employee number 427's job was simple He sat at his desk in room 427 And he pushed buttons on the keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor at his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. And although others might have considered it soul-ending, it's a bit of a nightmare. That the orders came in, as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley. Este sonido un poquito alto. Bueno, es que está mi voz un poco baja, pero porque tengo voz de mañana. Espera, esto está jodido. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting. O even say, Yo luego bien, ahora Corisa. Never in all his years. Mi presentación tiene que ser 50 minutos. 50 minutos. Esta gente no conoce el Pocachuca este. Frozen solid. Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. Vale, para empezar te puedes quedar, ¿no? En la oficina puedes no salir. Vale, vamos a empezar obedeciendo al narrador. All of his coworkers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Va muy rápido Stanley, eh, corre un huevo. Este juego me encanta, yo nunca me lo he pasado. Me ayudarás, ayúdame a sacarme los finales. Pero bueno, acabo de empezar, o sea que De momento vas a hacerle caso. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. He jugado dos, final de esto tres, creo. Vale. Momento, vamos a hacerle caso. Mira, cuando hago clic sobre nada, se oye un teclado. Lo he desbloqueado, no puedes saltar. Lo he desbloqueado, consigue tu primer logro. Ah, por, por darle a la barra espaciadora. <ríe> Me le he dado sin querer. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Targets. Push for funding for RD or new coffee machine. Standard Seger Group for Dice. Not, not cost efficient. Get Chris out of the broom closet. <laughs> hire, hire someone to synergize papers. Syn synergize? Papers are too synergized. <risa> fire papers guy. Hire somebody fire the papers. <risa> Synergizing guy. Who my desk? Please keep the target of the topic. The future was yesterday, tomorrow is now. Tomorrow. Complete today's unfinished agenda. Y items. Grind next day agendas. Reflect. <risa> Employee 417, 405, 19. Jim. <risa> Dios. Es como todo súper genérico, ¿no? No no, no se sabe qué vende esta empresa. Hostia, mira el gráfico, ¿eh? La sinergia de Core Global Paradigma 2012-2010 y algo. Este juego es del 10 y algo, tío. Qué tiempos. Y aquí un gráfico. ¿Aquí qué dice? Hostia, qué genérico el... 
Se habló intermesa, ¿eh? <risa> Clear skin. <risa> Metamorfosis. Fútbol. About. Pollution. ¿Por pollution? Mitosis. Eh, Tispa no se ha despedido. Habla menos. Pensaba con el Sinner ya ese, ¿eh? No significa nada ese verbo, tío. Moneta is free to play. <risa> ¿Qué quiere la gente? Cosas. Dinero. ¿Qué pone ahí? Happy. Happy. Pelling. Pel, no sé. Violet James, you are fire. <ríe> 2013 empezó como un mod. Lanzado en 2011. Ah, tiene pinta de siempre. Empezó como un mod. <ríe> A lo top percentage. Teenagers. Side of demographic. Spare. Bit, spare between the teenagers. Throw some in the rain. No more beans. Trash cam. Renaming of the ideas. Freaking on me. Ideas bin. Be quarterly por los reviews review. We need more less reviews. Ay, <ríe> hey, hola, ¿qué tal? ¿Cómo estáis? Buenos días. Want to get rid of the death sport portion in the primary review schedule. But I think that's a stupid idea. More water coolers, more water cooler heaters. <ríe> <risa> Charles need to be more eh, hip to appeal to teenage demographic. <risa> Find teenagers to put in the teenage demographic. <risa> Big net. Some, some sort of child trade. <risa> oh, Dios. Este es mi, mi tipo de humor favorito. <risa> Graphics about things and money. We have our new product. <risa> P. Stripes. <ríe> Requires more secondary research. Target demography teenagers. What is hot? <ríe> profit, 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 profit. Telephone directory. Stock market is somewhere here. Colored in segment. <ríe> Colored in segment. <ríe> oh, Dios, me encanta. Everyone is unique. You must of all. <ríe> Number of slides, 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 charts, slides, and charts. <ríe> Ahí pone Profits en medio de los Profits. ¡Hostia, es verdad! <ríe> ¡Qué locura! <ríe> right of Increased Grave Per Sites. <ríe> Te pone como cre... ¿Cómo? No more charts. A ver. <ríe> Esta sala es oro, tío. Venga, va, a seguir. Uy, aquí es donde estaba Jim. Stanley stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here, so he turned around and got back on track. ¿Puedo cerrar? ¿Y quedarme aquí? There was nothing here. No choice to make, no path to follow. Just an empty broom closet. Vale. No reason to still be here. Vale, hay que guardarse los finales, eh... Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his Hay que guardarse dónde podemos romper, ¿eh? Dónde podemos sacar cosas que sean fuera. De momento vamos a hacer la lógica. De momento obedecemos. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Creo que te cogía... La que hacía lo contrario. No, hombre, yo quiero sacarlos todos. What dark secret was being held from him? What he could not have known was that the keypad behind the boss's desk guarded the terrible truth that his boss had been keeping from him. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret pin number. 2845. Pero, por supuesto, Stanley no podía posiblemente haber sabido esto. Aquí nos han hecho la... El, el, el metarol, ¿eh? ¿Cuándo, ¿Cuál era? Mira, se me ha olvidado. ¿Se, ¿Os acordáis? 2, 8, 4... ¿Y qué más? Se me ha olvidado. Stanley just sat around twiddling his thumbs. Cinco. Trying to input anything on no, the device was useless. ¡Missy! He could never possibly know that the... Yet incredibly, by simply pushing random buttons on the... ¡Missy, por favor, eh! Stanley happened to input the correct code by sheer luck. Amazing. He stepped into the newly opened passageway. Soy mala para los números. Missy, por favor, ¿eh? Que te, además, no tendrías que estar dirigiendo. Ah. 
Descending deeper into the building, Stanley realized he felt a bit peculiar. It was a stirring of emotion in his chest, as though he felt more free to think for himself, to question the nature of his job. Why did he feel this now, when for years it had never occurred to him? This el... question would not go unanswered for long. Metarol. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Escape. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. What horrible secret did this place hold? Stanley thought to himself. Did he have the strength to find out? Now the monitors jumped to life. Fire. Their true nature revealed. Fire. Each bore the number of an employee in the building. Stanley's co-workers. The lives of so many individuals reduced to images on a screen. And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where... ¿Cuál es el mío? 4, 5, 7, ahí. Ahí está ahí. This mind control facility, it was too horrible to believe. It couldn't be true. Had Stanley really been under someone's control all this time? Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That his emotions had been manipulated to accept it blindly? Te pareció olvidable, ¿no te gustó Stanley Parabol, Musa? No. Pues habrá que ver. He refused to believe it. He couldn't accept it. His own life in someone else's control? Never! It was unthinkable, wasn't it? Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? O sea, el punto es siempre que llegues a... Ah, se me pone a ver de que sin más, ¿no? El punto es que hagas este final primero porque ahí ya... The heart of the operation. Controls labeled with emotions. Happy or sad or content, walking, eating, working, all of it monitored and commanded from this very place. And as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. For he would dismantle the controls once and for all. Blackness and a rising chill of uncertainty. Yes, there. Was it over? <laughs> yes, he had won. He had defeated the machine. Buen juego, cinco cinco de Steve. Sí, sí es. Ya me lo he pasado. Command. Freedom was mere moments away. He encontrado el final. Si llegas al final te has pasado un juego. Incluso si hay muchos, todo el mundo lo sabe. Stanley reflected on how many puzzles still lay unsolved. Where had his co-workers gone? How had he been freed from the machine's grasp? Debería, ahora que acabo de empezar, debería dibujar un mapa de las decisiones de Stanley. None of this mattered to him. For it was not knowledge or even power that he had mapa. been seeking. Para ver dónde me dejo cosas. Perhaps his goal had not been to understand, no tengo mi libreta. but to let go. Bueno, pero vamos a terminar. No longer would anyone tell him where to go, what to do, or how to feel. Whatever life he lives, it will be his, and that was all he needed to know. It was perhaps the only thing oh. worth knowing. Stanley stepped. Through the open door, Stanley felt the cool breeze upon his skin, the feeling of liberation, the immense possibility of the new path before him. This was exactly the way 
right now, that things were meant to happen. And Stanley was happy. Podría trabajar los fines de semana, ¿cómo vamos? ¡Ostras! Mucho ánimo, bigotillos. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo estás? Acabamos de pasarnos el juego. Loro es bloqueado. Termina el juego, ya está. Me pasó el juego. Lo puedo añadir a mi lista de juegos completados. Ya está, me lo pasé. Venga, chicos, pues muchas gracias. Ah, te manda directamente. Vale, a ver, entonces, empezar de cero. Eh... Vale, voy a, voy a apuntar los finales que voy sacando. O sea, las, los finales no. Voy a apuntar... O oh, no, lo podemos hacer... Mejor, lo podemos hacer eh, en Paint, aquí, y así se ve. <risa> si me ayudáis. Eh, esto va a ser fatal. A ver. Eso más esto los overlays. Puedo crear un overlay en directo. Paint. Eh, paint. Modo estudio para que no se vean los, los tejemanejes. ¿Por qué tengo el boli? Puedo duplicar en realidad. Duplicar. Paint. Aquí quitamos Stanley. Me hago un poquito más grande. Y metemos... Capturar ventana. Paint. Paint. Eh, vamos a agrandarlo a la pantalla. ¿Vale? Ahí. La cosa es que yo me vengo aquí. Y ahora dibujo. Cada vez te pasa el juego más rápido. A ver. Eh... Vale, vamos a dibujar el principio, ¿no? Este es el principio. Vale, entonces eh, Vamos a ir O sea, viendo las Estas que hemos tomado Y donde podemos, de hecho me lo debería volver a pasar En esta, en esta, vale, vamos a volver a pasárnoslo Hasta el momento de dar al botón Porque le hemos dado a off, le podemos dar a on Vale, vamos a volver a pasárnoslo hasta darle el botón Y vamos, ca y vamos cartografiando el, el árbol De decisiones, vale para empezar, me puedo quedar aquí. But Stanley simply couldn't handle the pressure. What if he had to make a decision? What if a crucial outcome fell under his responsibility? Este es otro final, ¿no? He had never been trained for that. No. This couldn't go any way except badly. Este es enfermito, Levi, te quiero. Now Levy, te Stanley quiero. thought to himself, is to wait. Nothing will hurt me. Nothing will break me. In here I can be happy forever. I will be happy. Stanley waited. Hours passed. Then days. Had years gone by? He no longer had the ability to tell. But the one thing he knew for sure, beyond any doubt, was that if he waited long enough, the answers would come. Eventually, someday, <laughs> they would arrive. Soon, very soon now, this will end. He will be spoken to. He will be told what to do. Now it's just a little bit closer. Now it's even closer. Here it comes. <risa> Se acabó. B final. <risa> vale. Ok. Este es un final. <risa> vale. Entonces, es un final. Es un final. No lo digo yo. Entonces, esto nos lleva a un final. Eh, ¿Cómo declaramos? Eh, pues hacer un poco más grande, ¿no? ¿Cómo declaramos que esto ha sido? A ver, a ver, esperar. Uy, espera. Tengo esto gigantesco. 10. Eh, Tienes. Vale. Eso va a hacer mejor. Va a ser una X roja. O sea, los finales van a ser en, en rojo. Ahí. Esperar en la oficina. Este es un final. Vale. ¡Ah! Está quedando bien. Ah, vale, espera, y hay que hacer el otro, que es con color negro. Negro, he dicho negro. Voy a ir por aquí. Vale, va a ser torcido. Pero bueno, es como una pizarra, ¿no? Es, es, todo esto es un. Es un metameme en sí mismo. Tengo un meme para ti, luego te lo subo a Twitter. El señor del capitalismo. No al final ha sido que ya se han trabajando. <risa> hay que ver. Vale. Eh, vale, avanzamos. All of his co-workers were gone. 
What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No matter how Uy. hard Stanley looked, he este couldn't find encendido. a trace of his Ojo, co-workers. Eh. Oh. Ese estaba encendido. Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference. Nor <laughs> did it advance the story in any way. <laughs> Hacer una línea recta para indicar que ya se toca. Sí, 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 eso voy a hacer. La línea del final, bueno, va a ser una línea recta y a partir de ahí ramificamos. Pero quiero, pero quiero ver las diferentes decisiones que he podido tomar. Puedo apagar ordenadores. Cinco, seis. Eso no es. Ah, vale, no, son otras. Ocho, cinco. Hay algo ahí. Hostia, está jugando al póker, míralo, al solitario. Ese está echando un solitario. El de, la, el, de la, el de ese se está haciendo una, un solitario, el de la 2.5. Mira lo que cabrito. Y ese tío está jugando a los marcianitos. Todavía en la mejor pun de. De todo Avengers, eh. Sales in this quarter. <ríe> está súper bajo. ¿Y qué pone ahí? <ríe> this does not make sense. No, es que no veo. Estoy... Ah, mira aquel. 4 B3. ¿A que no es 483? Es B3. Uh. Vale. Dos puertas. Entonces, ahora vamos a hacer la división entre. Uy, qué grueso. Como mi pene. Eh, vamos a hacer la división de otra puerta. Puerta derecha. Vale, y es una de estas que tenemos abierta. Porque hemos cogido la de la izquierda. Perfecto. Uy, espera, se me va a olvidar. Una cosa que se me va a olvidar mucho y necesito que me recordéis es que se me va a quedar en la pantalla del Pain mientras juego. <risa> Eso necesito que me lo aviséis. Me quedé, está súper encendido. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling away. ¿Cuál has cogido? La buena, la buena, la buena. Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Vamos a llegar hasta el botón. Find an answer there. Vale, puedo volver. No. Yo porque alguna a lo mejor es volver hacia atrás. A ver. Vale, hay que investigar, hay que investigar. De momento estamos siguiendo el, el camino bueno. Mira, el Broom Closet. Vale, vamos a apuntar Broom Closet. O sea, cuarto de la escoba. A lo mejor no es un final, pero no lo sé. Así que por si acaso lo voy a, lo voy a apuntar. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked vale. upstairs to his boss's office. Escalera abajo. Ahí, ahí no. Escalera. No soy el primer loco que cartografía esto. ¿Qué pasa, Stanley? Claramente dije que coger la puerta de la derecha. No apuntes, vívelo. No, yo voy a apuntar. Claro que voy a apuntar, mira. Mira, tremendo Excel me estoy haciendo. ¿Has visto? Mira, mira que. Ahí. Mira que Excel. O sea, Excel, perdón. Paint. Estoy haciendo un paint. Vívelo, no es tan extenso. No, hombre, no. No te preocupes. Quiero apuntar todos los caminos. Hostia, el baño ejecutivo, eh. Ojo. Because the boss knows what that what the boss says goes, if the boss suffer loose, that, that's what the boss choose. Tengo ni idea. Extreme bathroom, bathrooms. Time. Because the esto es algo. Because the boss knows that what the boss says goes, 
If the boss suffer loss, then what's, that's what the boss choose. Dado que el jefe sabe. Es un trabalenguas. No, me lo imagino. En inglés es un, en inglés es un trabalenguas. Las páginas bait. <risa> las páginas amarillas, las páginas bait. Ojo, eh. Vale. Eh, puerta derecha del jefe. Puerta derecha, jefe. Vale. El jefe sabe que lo que dice es... Como el jefe sabe que lo que dice se hace, si el jefe tiene pérdidas es porque quiere. Ah, tiene incluso sentido, fíjate. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. What could it mean? Stanley wondered aloud to nobody. He began wildly tearing through papers on the boss's desk, pulling books off the shelf. Looking behind paintings, desperate for clues to Esto no me lo ha dicho antes, ¿no? But his attention was caught by a keypad behind the boss's desk. What could its purpose be? In fact, this keypad guarded the terrible secret that lay buried below his feet. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret pin number. 2845. 2845. But of course, Stanley couldn't possibly have known this. Pues entonces se da puerta del jefe antes que se cierre y cambien cosas. Vale, pues no lo sabía. Salir puerta del jefe. Pero no me digas nada, Brick. Todavía, jolín, no me hagas spoiler. Cuéntame las cosas si las pregunto. Solo si las pregunto. Antes no. Esa es la, la regla del streamer. Si alguien pregunta algo, se lo dices. O si no puedes preguntar, ¿quieres que te diga algo? No llegarías nunca a esa. Ya, pero. Pero lo pregunto. Pero bueno, ya me lo podrías decir en otro momento. ¡Qué tela! Esto es distinto. Ah, no. Stanley walk straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control. Aquí tenemos escape. De momento estamos viendo un montón de maneras de salir. Pero bueno, que estas maneras se ramificarán en otras y en otras y en otras. Vale, aquí no va a haber nada, solamente el... Me puedo tirar, ojo, eh. Me tiro. Me puedo tirar. Ajá. You've made it to the bottom of the mind control facility. Welcome. You see, back when the Stanley Parable first launched in 2013, getting to the bottom of the mind control facility was a bug that we simply didn't catch during development. And you all sent us lots of photos of it on Twitter and acted very superior about it. And you're all very, very clever. Good for you. Anyway, when it came time to update the game, we knew that we had to do something about this little goof of ours. So... Here you go. New content. You can call it the bottom of the mind control room ending, if that enhances your perception of the value of these updates. Isn't that what you crave? New content? <laughs> Always more content, more content, more, 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 more. And I'm here to give it to you. I'm here to make it seem like we really covered every nook and cranny <laughs> of the game with secrets and Easter eggs. How about this? We wrote a new piece of music <laughs> just for this section. You won't hear it anywhere else in the game. It's a secret that's just for you. That's how special you are. We call this track, Good Job You've Made It to the Bottom of the Mind Control Facility. Well done. Good job. You did it. Good job. Good 
job You made it to the bottom of the mind control facility You jumped on the catwalk You should have been careful You should have been careful It used to be a bug But now it's an ending Now it's an ending I believe in you I believe in your ability To cross this barrier And chase your dreams But railings don't mean anything Good job, you did it Good job, you did it Good job, you did it <risa> Esto era un bug y ahora es un final Good job, you did it 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 Y se acabó. De 10. De 10. De 10. Juega ral. Juega ral. Mira, 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 mira. Saltar a la pasarela. De 10. Esto era un bug y ahora es un final, me parece. De 10. No lo sabía. No sabía. O sea, he visto que se podía saltar. No sabía que. Que era un. Que era un bug antes. De 10. Bueno, vamos a seguir. Bueno, vamos rápido, eh. <risa> Nos mandasteis un montón de fotos en Twitter. ¿Habéis jugado a la versión normal de Stanley? No, esta es mi primera vez. Esta es la primera vez que juego. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. <risa> Puedo. Esto era un bug, pero ahora. <risa> The moment he entered his manager's office, ¿Cuál era? Mierda. Stanley froze in his tracks. Not a living soul anywhere. Eh... Could he really be all alone? Tenéis ahí arriba. This was too much for Stanley to take. Too much for Dos, ocho, cuatro, cinco. He fell to his knees, Uy, bursting into half moans, half sobs, the guttural retching of life from a man denied any hope, any reason to keep going. Here on the floor, he lay. Stanley was in such a rush to get through the story. Mira, quickly as cambia, possible, la, cambia lo que dice. He didn't even have a single minute to just let the narrator talk. That kind of anxiety isn't healthy. Mira. So he relaxed for a few moments with some calming new age music. <risa> Por ir rápido <risa> Por ir despacio <risa> Me apoyé <risa> Como he ido súper rápido <risa> Por ir corriendo <risa> oh, no. Madre mía Por ir corriendo me ha puesto musiquita tranquilizadora <risa> Porque iba súper rápido Yo estoy jugando a la nueva versión Ultra Deluxe. Sí, sí, esta es la de Ultra Deluxe. Estoy jugando a la, a la Ultra Deluxe. Pero ya digo, es la primera vez. ¿eh? Si yo dije a Steam, y luego se llama No puedes conseguir este logo, directamente no podías todo eso. Esto ya lo hemos cartografiado. Pero ese logro yo he visto que alguien lo pillaba, ¿no? Entiendo que mediante bugs. Nos hemos caído antes. Y ese sin querer. Y es que entrar al código fuente. Ah, claro. Tendría que darle un try de nuevo. A ver. Joder, no me estoy pasando Aquí hay algo que ver. Por alguna es... ¿Alguna tiene algún secreto o algo? Tiene un error. Hay un círculo rojo. Me da un comando de pulsión de un botón, te da el logro. Para que cosa no se puede, así que no lo he hecho. Está la cámara pirata. Cámara pirata. Que seguro que en estas cámaras hay de todo, tío. Pero, uf, No veo ni mierda. Nomás se repiten. 
mejor no están todos los números o algo así. ¿Está la 013 o algo así? 13 está ahí. Yo voy a ser un padre de empleo despedido en esas pantallas. Sí, algunos están Fined. Por ahí había. Mira, hay un Fined. Pero no sale nadie, ¿no? No hay gente. No sé, estoy intentando ver, pero no, no veo nada. Después de jugar esto, tienes que ver Severance. Es una peli esa. ¿Had Stanley really been under someone's control all this time? Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That his emotions had been manipulated to accept it blindly? Un poco arriba a la izquierda. Una serie de una temporada. No. He refused to believe it. He couldn't accept it. His own life in Porque no caben todas. Porque hay un 300 pero no hay un 200. Wasn't it? Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? But here was the proof, the heart of the operation. Controls labeled with emotions, happy or sad or content, walking, eating, working, all of it monitored and commanded from this very place. And as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. For he would dismantle vale. the controls once and for all. Y aquí tenemos on y off. Off nos da el final que ya hemos hecho. A ver. Off nos da el final. Y ahora le vamos a dar a on. Y esto nos saca a otro lado. Stanley, If you want to throw my story off track, you're going to have to do much better than that. I'm afraid you don't have nearly the power you think you do. For example, and I believe you'll find this pertinent, Stanley suddenly realized he had just initiated the network's emergency detonation system. In the event that this machine is activated without proper DNA identification, nuclear detonators are set to explode, eliminating the entire complex. How long until detonation then? Let's say um, two minutes. Oh! Ah, now this is making things a little more fun, isn't it, Stanley? It's your time to shine. You are the star. It's your Dos story minutos. now. Shape it to your heart's desires. Oh, this is much better than what I had in mind. What a shame we have so little time left. Se puede apagar. Hay un montón de. Ah, mira, uno, cuatro, cuatro. Mierda, pero es un pegado. Uno, uno rojo. About me. Where we're going? What all this means? I barely know where to start. Un azul, mierda. What's that? You'd like to know where your co-workers are. A moment of solace before you're abducted. Any key to this ship? All right, I'm in a good mood. You're gonna die anyway. I'll tell you. Un azul, no veo un azul. I erased them. I turned off the machine. I set you free. Azul. Ah, vale. Uno y azul. That was merely in this instance of the story. Sometimes when I tell it, I simply let you sit there in your office forever, pushing buttons endlessly and then dying alone. Diez azul. Me puedo ir. Other times, I let the office sink into the ground, swallowing everyone inside, or I let it burn to a crisp. I have to say this though. Mejor sonido. Se ha activado. Lo he activado. It has been rather amusing. Watching you try to make sense of everything and take the control wrested away from you, it's quite a bitch. I almost hate to see it go. Es verdad. But I'm sure whatever I come up with on the next go around will be even better. My goodness, only 34 seconds left. Eh? But I'm enjoying this so much. You know what? Se ha abierto una puerta. I'm going to put some extra time on the clock. Why not? Charts. These are precious additional seconds, Stanley. Time doesn't grow. Ha metido más tiempo? Oh dear me, what's the matter, Stanley? 
Is it that you have no idea where you're going or what you're supposed to be doing right now? Or did you just assume when you saw that timer that something in this room was capable of turning it off? I mean, look at you. Running from button to button, screen to screen, clicking on every little thing in this room. <risa> Pero la gente intenta solucionar este final, se me fascina, no se puede, ¿verdad? Or maybe this big red button, or this door, everything, anything, something here will save me. Why would you think that? Es horrible. Es que tienes como la... la... One soul? Do you have any idea what your purpose in this place is? <risa> Stand me. You're in a ah! disappointment, but here's a spoiler for you. That timer isn't a catalyst to keep eh. the action moving along. It's just seconds ticking away to your death. You're only still playing instead of watching a cutscene. I'm gonna watch you for <laughs> every mal. moment that you're powerless to see you made humble. Ah! Not a challenge. It's a <laughs> no. You wanted to control ah. this world. No. Qué mal. Esto es muy horrible. First, so you can't. Ah. The clock standing. That's 30 seconds you have left to struggle. Qué mal la música, tío. Until a big boom and then nothing. No ending here. Just you being blown to pieces. Ah. No. <laughs> Por favor. Esto es muy horrible. Another choice. Make it count. Or don't. It's all the same to me. All a part of the joke. And believe me, I will be laughing at every second of your inevitable. No quiero mirar. <laughs> no quiero mirar. Me voy a la esquina a llorar. <laughs> Uf, qué horror. <risa> vale. Ok. Vale. Eh, final de on en rojo. Vale. Eso por ahí. Eh, vamos a ir ahora a, a escape. Vamos a ir siempre hacia el final más largo. ¿No? O debería ir... Entiendo que es, que es más lógico si voy siempre hacia el final más largo. Seguro que hay una combinación. Yo no tacharía tan rápido. Joder, no creo. Bueno, se puede editar. Pero no me va a volver a ese final, que es horrible. Vale, no puedo ir muy rápido, que si no, se enfada. Yo me saqué todos los logros de Steam y no había combinación. Y no encontré y había combinación ahí. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Vale, de momento hemos dicho que seguiríamos, ¿no? Vale, seguimos lo que dice. Conociendo el final de este juego, seguro que tenga combinación, aunque no te dé logro. Hay finales que no te dan logro, ¿eh? Hay o sea, lo los logros no van por final. Haz de una finta a la puerta del jefe. Sí, pero eso luego. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Eso luego, vamos a ir por orden. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Sí, hay un montón de, de finales, pero vamos a, vamos a hacer, de momento, caso hasta ir sacando poco a poco. Aquí puedo ir por aquí o puedo hacer la finta, pero no la voy a hacer. Ok, I think we all know the drill by now. Bla, bla, bla. Dark secrets, the keypad. Stanley pushes some buttons. Oh, hey, look, it's a new passageway. Kill surprise. <risa> Por favor. Por favor. Deja de... <risa> ¿Cuál era? Mierda, no sé. <risa> Te lo ha pasado rápido. <risa> Qué grande. <risa> Te lo ha pasado rápido. <risa> Esas mini iteraciones son las guays. <ríe> Te lo he pasado rápido. Flipante. ¡Hostia! Ah, oh, perfecto. Qué guay. Perdón. <coughs> ah. Stanley walks straight ahead through the large door that read Mind vale. Control Facility. Y aquí nos vamos hacia Escape. Although this passageway had the word Escape written on it, 
The truth was that at the end of this hall, Stanley would meet his violent death. <laughs> the door behind him was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. At this point, Stanley was making a conscious, concerted effort to walk forward and willingly confront his death. ¿En serio? Ah, no. As the machine whirred into motion and Stanley was inched closer and closer to his demise, he reflected that his life had been over ah, sí que es el final. whatsoever. Stanley can't see the bigger picture. He doesn't know the real story. Trapped forever in his narrow vision of what ahí. this world is. Perhaps no se puede saltar. No great loss, like plucking the eyeballs from a blind man. And so he resigned and willingly accepted this violent end to his brief and shallow life. Farewell, Stanley. Hay un botón, hay un botón. Ah, no, no es un botón. Farewell, Stanley, cried the narrator, as Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. In a single visceral instant, Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed every bone in his body, killing him instantly. And yet it would be just a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game back in his office as alive as ever. What exactly did the narrator think he was going to accomplish? When every path you can walk has been created for you long in advance, death becomes meaningless, making life the same. Do you see now? Do you see that Stanley was already dead from the moment he hit start? Wow. El más de 100 ideas que usé para el juego, para así se movió y se identificó para jugar y llegar a dos puertas en un buen tiempo. Las dos puertas, el escenario de dos puertas abiertas fue la primera pieza concreta del diseño de Stanley para. Una vez que se creó esta habitación, el resto del juego surgió como una extensión, después de la contradicción que se planteaba. Archivadores. Wow. <risa> Computadora de Stanley. Pinturas de naturaleza. La oficina. Sonidos de botones. Selecciona los sonidos que utiliza el juego cuando se ponen botones. Cada uno de ellos se combina un tono sintetizado de sonidos que se produce presionando un teclado. Qué guapo está este juego. No querías cartografía, pues ahí tienes un mapa. Diseño de modelo, arte original, música original, diseño de sonido, créditos. Ah, mira. Los diferentes ordenadores, computadores de la oficina. La oficina. Sala de mantenimiento. Una versión inicial de la sala de mantenimiento. Es un puto museo, eh. Zona de guerra. Las primeras etapas de desarrollo se llaman un final que está y termina un campo de batalla luchado contra el indígena. Se fue a hacer con... cobrar conciencia y declarar la guerra al narrador. Poco después de empezar a construir, nos dimos cuenta que era demasiado jocoso y literal para el tono del juego. Además, algunas personas interpretaban nos burlamos de los amantes de los juegos de disparos y esa no era nuestra intención. Hostia puta. <risa> Fan. ¿Estos son finales? ¿Que se pueden sacar? Empiezas en parábola y acabas jugando al galo. ¿Estos son finales que se pueden sacar? 
Diversión en el... Ah, no, pero no es la misma, en el mismo sitio. Sí, porque este es que te estás cayendo. ¡Ojo, eh! Vídeo en YouTube. En la 36. ¡Ojo, eh! Hay que sacar anuncios de Ultra Deluxe. En diciembre de 2018 hicimos un anuncio de versión Ultra Deluxe de Stanley Parable de Nine Wars. Aquí se muestran capturas de pantalla los vídeos que hicimos para anuncio y retraso del juego. O sea, este es que te caes. Entonces tiene que haber estos, estos finales, tienen que estar también. Esto tiene que ser algo. Voy a sacar la captura. Vale, no sé sacar captura. FN, imprimir pantalla. No. Imprimir pantalla. Ah, no, me guardan el drive. Bueno, pues no hay ni mierda. Correos electrónicos al narrador. Después de presentar el segundo... Ah, vale. Después de presentar el segundo avance, le pedimos a la gente que enviara preguntas por correo electrónico al narrador. Planea usar otros materiales publicitarios, pero nunca encontramos un lugar adecuado. Ahí puedes encontrar la sección de estos correos electrónicos. ¿Qué hacen las luces en la sala de control? Que realmente quiero saberlo. Soy Antonio Elías, soy el que <risa> ¿Son de verdad? Hola, Mr. Narrador Tengo una pregunta para ti ¿Cuál es tu mensaje del día? ¿Esto es de verdad? ¿Son correos que lo mandan de verdad? Hay un esqueleto dentro de ti <risa> Hay más esqueletos en este mundo que humanos <risa> eh, ¿Soy Stanley? ¿Me estás espiando? ¿Por qué? ¿Cómo? <risa> ¿Tendrá el juego la, fe, la, la, la fetur de capibaras? <risa> ¿Qué verdad? ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo te mantienes en forma? <risa> Michael de Rock Martin. <risa> ¿Eh? ¿Are you gay? <risa> Joder. ¿Lo he pasado sin querer? ¿Por qué se ha pasado el de antes? El primer sitio puede estar en es bueno, ahora está en la PC de Grey de Intuar, which is why I'm in the Quirbo and Stan Alone Companion Game. El Blade to Hover son medio viejos. Bueno. Voy a estar de paro de Jalin Infinite Quest, how many endings. Está de paro de One to Eat, de mi shopping. I hope you will have a seguido en Desert Boots. Bueno, luego me cuentas que parece la movida esta. How do you make a JRPG? How do you make the worst game ever? What is the difference between the duck? The duck and what? Pone narrador, eh. Imagínate recibir estas mierdas de correo todo el rato, tío. Oye, a rock. Bueno, ya suficiente. La sala de empleados. Una versión inicial de la sala de empleados. La oficina. ¡Susto! El cronómetro de un apartamento. Una versión anterior de la elección conduce al final del apartamento. Un cronómetro de 15 segundos para tener el teléfono. O sea, tendrías si llegas a otro final. ¿Ah? No sé. El montacargas. La segunda versión cumple la misma función que el juego final, pero queríamos que se pareciera más a un lugar donde se almacenan mercancías. El objetivo del montacargas siempre fue hacer una opción de quedarse en él o saltar hacia otro camino. Sin embargo, después de esta versión inicial, dimos a la opción de que el jugador cayera a la muerte. Es que son sitios a los que aún no hemos llegado. Vale, por ahí será el, el bueno, ¿no? Ah, no. One option, two options. One option. Doorway to maintenance the lungs. Doorway to maintenance. Two doorways to maintenance. What about vents? Ah, esto es para entrar en mantenimiento. Tu confusion ending. Es que aún no hemos entrado en mantenimiento. Y además el mantenimiento, los pasillos que vienen luego de las dos puertas iniciadas eran importante, pero los jugadores los recorrían muchísimas veces. Probamos con visión de diseño, pero definitivamente ahora una versión más simple. 
O sea, esta. Cuando desobedezca, iré a loans y iréis a mantenimiento. Vale. Vale, me queda un sitio por mirar. Me queda un puto huevo en realidad. Los de la oficina. El reloj está en hora, ¿eh? Porque al principio el juego te pregunta la hora. Sí. Entonces, ah, bueno, no está... No exactamente. Está mal. Oficina de jefe. Imagen de desarrollo de oficina de jefe. Hostia. Es puto enorme el museo este, ¿eh? Está en subterránea. A ver si hay ciudad de antes de ganar el juego. Que van, Brain y Abode en la Loga. el diálogo todo el juego en tres momentos diferentes a lo largo de los años de desarrollo. Aquí hay todas las iniciativas en su sala de juego. Stanley pushed the number six. Qué miedo, ¿no? When Stanley came to the lift, he traveled upward to the power source at the top of the facility. Qué miedo. El narrador hablando solo. <coughs> final de la libertad, esa primera versión, final de la libertad del juego. Escritura de la cuenta regresiva, una vez escritura de la versión inicial de la cuenta regresiva. Ah, vale. Modelo final de Zen. El final Zen tuvo muchas iteraciones. Esta se ha presentado a la cuarta versión del final. Pensamos que había terminado. Vecinos a donde había modificado una vez poco antes del lanzamiento. No sé qué final es este. The game is now paused. Begin the game again. Resume the game. Otro retorno. Final del menú. Durante mucho tiempo tuvimos un final que solo terminaba cuando el jugador reiniciaba desde el modo escape. Por desgracia, muchas personas se habían dado cuenta de esto era lo que había que hacer, lo cual fue frustrante para todo el mundo. Palancas del final Zen. Las palancas están parte del final Zen. O el jugador hacía las palancas de la hora de escribir que lo había accionado. Me estoy haciendo spoiler, eh, del juego entero. Lanzamos cuatro veces principales durante desarrollar el juego, cada uno de los cuales se metió un aspecto de espíritu del juego. Este es el primero, publicado en 2012. En ese de una serie de habitaciones rotas de verdad narrado que se informa de espectadores que están probando en la versión de Stanley Parable. Este juego es una pasada, tío. Esto es un puto laberinto, ¿eh? Ah. Ah, he vuelto aquí. Final Zen. Esta vez hemos tomado la decisión inicial. Final conocido, final Zen. Que luego se descartó y se comió con otra parte del juego. Ah, vale. Que el final Zen está descartado. Eh, salida. Tocáis ahí para hacer los pollos finales, ¿no? No, hombre, no. Voy a ver todo lo que hay. A ver, eso es el monitor, no tengo tiempo de hacer eso. De bajar, de tal, de tal, de tal, de tal. Mira, ya que he llegado. Oficina Stanley, izquierda, derecha, oficina de oficina Stanley. Pero no sé que en noviembre del 2011, en marzo del 20 del 12 y 13 en febrero del 13. Dejo de fondo mientras preparo unos muchos archivos que tengo que mandar cada dos horas. ¿Qué coñazo? Esta es la final, ¿no? No cambia mucha cosa. Mola porque aquí es todo súper sobrio, ¿eh? No hay, no hay ninguna puya. Esto es de verdad un museo del desarrollo del juego. <risa> oh, look at these two. How they wish to destroy one another. How they wish to control one another. How they both wish to be free. Solo hay una opción. Can you see? Can you see how much they need one another? No, perhaps not. Sometimes these things cannot be seen. Oh. But listen to me. You can still save those two. You can stop the program before they both fail. Push escape and press quit. There's no other way to beat Bravo. this game. As long as you move forward, you'll be walking someone else's path. Stop now, and it'll be your only true choice. Whatever you do, choose it. Don't let time choose for you. Don't let time. Se puede hacer. 
Tío, ahora lo tengo en duda. Mierda. <risa> ¡Eh! ¿Ha cambiado? Es otra oficina. ¡Uh! Ojo, 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 ojo. A ver. Escape. Escape me da el final del museo. Museo. Y ahí voy a poner un interrogante. En, en morado, por ejemplo. ¿Puedo apagar el juego cuando muera? Porque eso podría ser otro final. Hostia. Eh, ha cambiado el layout, ¿eh? Es distinto. Qué movida. All of his coworkers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley well, decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Welcome to the whiteboard ending. Hemos activado el modo perro, eh. O sea, el final de la pizarra blanca, que es llegar aquí. Dime que habla como un perro. Dime que habla como un perro. Hostia, pues espero que no. Stanley went around touching every little no. thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference. No, did it advance the story in any way. Qué pena. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Ah, son mis clics. Qué horrible. <risa> Mis clics ahora son perros No puedo salir No quiero el modo perro Porque ha cambiado el layout Bueno, vamos a apuntar final de la pizarra blanca Porque es un, es un final al fin y al cabo <risa> Final pizarra Está como nada más entrar Final pizarra blanca No es un final No es un final técnicamente No lo voy a apuntar porque no es un final Tío, modo perro Qué, horror, qué horrible Vale, ahora hay que ir a salir de la puerta del jefe. ¡Ah! Solo es cuando no hay nada con lo que interactuar. Aquí puedo hacer el quiebro también. ¡Ah! No F-Stream. ¿Sí? ¿Se ha caído? Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. A ver, ¿se ha caído? ¿Ahora? Eh, yo lo veo bien no, no he perdido ningún fotograma Todo está perfecto Se te habrá ido un poquitillo Sí, se os habrá ido Ah, vale, vale, vale Sí, pues a lo mejor he perdido yo un... No sé, no me sale que haya perdido nada Vale Uh Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Modo perro. Lo tengo que desactivar, eh. Vale, hay que salir de la oficina. En fin. Eh, vale, hay que hacer el quiebro. Ah, mira, está abierto ya. Hay que hacer el quiebro, eh. ¡Ah! ¡No! No sé. No me ha dejado. ¿Cómo se hace? No me ha dejado. No he podido hacer el quiebro. Entraste demasiado. Ya, ¿qué hago? Pues mira, ya que estoy aquí, voy a hacer el final de. Voy a hacer. Voy a ver si puedo. Joder, el otro final. O sea, si hay una manera. Voy a investigar un poco. Stanley walk straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. <ríe> si la luz está encendida, llama a la extensión 914 inmediatamente. Although this passageway had the word escape written on it, the truth was oh, that at the end of this hall, Stanley would meet his violent death. 
O sea, vamos al museo y del museo al... A ver si saliendo del juego pasa algo. Que no creo, pero bueno. At this point, Stanley was making a conscious, concerted effort to walk forward and willingly confront his death. No creo que pase nada, pero bueno, por si acaso. Joder. Bigotillos, no he visto lo que me has pasado en Twitter. As the machine whirred into motion and Stanley was inched closer and closer to his demise, he reflected that his life had been O sea, si has subido algo en Twitter no lo he visto. No me has etiquetado. He doesn't know the real story. Trapped ah, vale. in his narrow vision Ahí, vale. of what this world is. Perhaps his death was of no great loss, like plucking the eyeballs from a blind man. And so he resigned and willingly accepted this violent end to his brief and shallow life. <laughs> Farewell, Stanley. <laughs> Te he citado, sí, sí, sí. Farewell, Stanley, cried the narrator. Ha tardado en mandarme la notificación. Into the enormous metal jaws. In a single visceral instant, Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed every bone in his body, killing him instantly. And yet it would be just a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game back in his office as alive as ever. What exactly did the narrator think he was going to accomplish? When every path you can walk has been created for you long in advance, death becomes meaningless, making life the same. Do you see now? Do you see that Stanley was already dead from the moment he hit start? Vamos rápido. <laughs> oh, look at these two. How they wish to destroy one another. How they wish to control one another. How they both wish to be free. Vale, y ahora? Can you see? Can you see how much they need one another? No, perhaps not. Some ahora voy a <laughs> apagar el juego. <laughs> a ver si eso cambia algo. But listen to me. You can still save this too. Porque eso no es un botón, no. Este es perro, ¿no? Push escape and press quit. There's no other way to beat this game. As long as you move forward, you'll be walking someone else's path. Stop now and it'll be your only true choice. Whatever you do, choose it. Don't let... Vale, pues no era un final. <risa> vale. Hemos desactivado el modo perro, al menos. Vale. All of his coworkers were gone. What could it mean? Stan had decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace becario, eh? Bueno, no mentira. Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office, modo perro. but it didn't make a single difference, nor did it advance the story in any way. ¿Y eso? No en your city. I hate Mondays. Oh, God. Hey, mira, esta, esta foto no salía en el museo. Lo de arriba. Hmm. Vale, entonces hay que entrar poquito. Vale, hay que entrar poquito. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Espiran. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs. Si voy muy rápido me va a poner música. Vale. Ya te la abre, me parece increíble. Vale, hay que entrar poquito. Vale. 
¡Ah! ¡Ah! Se cierra rapidísimo. Eh. Vale. Se cierra muy rápido, tío. I can't wait to tell this story to my coworkers, Stanley thought. How amusing they'll find it. Oh, won't we all just laugh and laugh at the time I thought everyone had gone missing? Lo que mola son los, eh, los cambios como este, ¿no? <risa> los, los mini cambios. Esto te lo tengo que decir sí o sí. sí. Tiene que activarse ese, ese input. Aunque sepa que ya, que, que ya estás explorando el bucle. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Pues esto es complicadísimo, ¿eh? Jo, tío, es que no puedo. Here's the door. Ah. Lo hice. No, se ha abierto esto. Esto ya estaba cerrado. Knows, ¿eh? Sabe que me he ido. ¡Ah! 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 Ahora te estás yendo. Escape, pod bay, floor 760. El narrador no, no habla, ya, ¿eh? no sabe dónde estoy. Sí, entiendo que el narrador se ha quedado, se ha quedado allí. Uh. Está atrapado en la rama del despacho del jefe. Ah, sí, está atrapado. Qué guay. Eres libre. <risa> 8. Son todos los pisos iguales, ¿eh? La misma habitación. Al igual ahora es todo el narrador, ojalá, ¿eh? Se me daría bien. Se me da bien narrar. 4, 3, 2. Siempre la misma. Escape pod launch bay. Escape pod. Eso, eso no es cápsula de escape. Ok, vale eh... Ah, mira, por cierto, esto no Hemos visto que esto no es un final Es ahí por la puerta del jefe Vamos a llamarlo Un poco cutre el final este Pero bueno, vamos a llamarlo eh, Escape pod Vale Ahora hay que hacerlo por la puerta que hay a la derecha del jefe, la del panda con una pistola.
Panda con pistola. Vamos para allá. Stanley knew the office layout like the back of his hand. It was only a matter of time before he found the others, wherever they were. No cambiará nada. Just a matter of time. Qué cabrón ha dicho eso. No habrá cambiado nada, ¿no? Lo mismo el layout cambia o algo, tío. Awaiting input. Input recibe. ¿Cómo? Estamos viendo el mapa. Ah, mierda. Vale, gracias, Brick. Ya dije que esto era posible que pasara. Awaiting input. Input recibe. Uh. Ahí, espera. Ahí. Mmm. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No me gusta esta sala, tío. What? ¿Qué pasa? Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. ¿Qué pasa? Hay como una tormenta. Ahora no. Ahora sí. Vale, ahora por aquí. Business strategy. Ah, no es, no es un final este. Ah, pues sí. Vale, podríamos ir abajo, eh. El final del ascensor. Va a ser larguísimo, ¿verdad? Va a ser jodidamente largo. <risa> He ido arriba, ¿no? Sí, he ido arriba. Mira, tenemos nuestra... Nuestra primera iteración... Aparte, ¿vale? Ah, no es un... ¿No? ¿Nada? Ah, vale, no es... No es nada Ah, pues... <ríe> Joder a la puta mierda mi iteración <risa> de hecho vamos a, vamos a juntarlos a, al mismo punto <risa> y aquí poner nada nada vale. <risa> no había nada efectivamente no había nada eh, venga así eh, ahora toca... ¿Qué toca? Es ir por las escaleras hacia abajo. Was Stanley. He was sure of it. ¡Oh! 
if he checked over his shoulder now, he would surely catch them. It was only a matter of time. ¡Qué miedo! No me digas eso, cabrón. Ah, ahora no está lo del input. Ah, no, eso era en la siguiente sala. ¡Qué susto! ¡Jolín, qué miedo! Ahora me he metido la paranoia. ¿Cómo me dices esto? Ah, ahora no está lo del input. ¡Qué mal! ¿Me está siguiendo alguien? ¡Qué mal! No, ¿verdad? <ríe> ¡Qué miedo! When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Esa tormenta antes no estaba. En algún momento el tío este dirá por la puerta de la derecha y nos cagaremos en, la, en todo. Yet there was not a single person here either. No está el proyector. Ah, vale, ahí disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Vale, ahora escalé hacia abajo. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. But Stanley just couldn't do it. He considered the possibility of facing his boss, admitting he had left his post during work hours. He might be fired for that. And in such a competitive economy, why had he taken that risk? All because he believed everyone had vanished. His boss would think he was crazy. And then something occurred to Stanley. Maybe, he thought to himself, maybe I am crazy. All of my co-workers blinking mysteriously out of existence in a single moment for no reason at all. None of it made any logical sense. And as Stanley pondered this, he began to make other strange observations. For example, why couldn't he see his feet when he looked down? Why did doors close automatically behind him wherever oh. he went? And for that matter, these rooms were starting to look pretty familiar. Were they simply repeating? No, Stanley said to himself, this is all too strange. This can't be real. Uh. And at last, he came to the conclusion that had been on the tip of his tongue. He just hadn't found the words for it. I'm dreaming, <laughs> he yelled. This is all a dream. Oh, what a relief Stanley felt to have finally found an answer, an explanation. His co-workers weren't actually gone. He wasn't going to lose his job. He wasn't crazy after all. And he thought to himself, I suppose I'll wake up soon. I'll have to go back to my boring real life job pushing buttons. No puede hacer I may as well enjoy this while I'm still lucid. So, he imagined himself flying and began to gently oh, float about the ah! ground. Then he imagined himself soaring through space on a magical star field. And it too appeared. It was so much fun. Wow. And Stanley marveled that he had ah! come up with an eye. How was he then making so lucid? And then perhaps the strangest question of them all entered Stanley's head. <laughs> Gracias por ese follow. Amazed, he hadn't asked himself sooner. Why is there a voice in my head? Hombre, caco. Everything that I'm doing. ¿Qué pasa? Thinking. ¿Cómo estás? Frescos días. Now the voice was describing itself being considered by Stanley, who found it particularly strange. I'm dreaming about a voice describing me, thinking about how it's describing my thoughts, he thought. And while he thought it all very odd, and wondered if this voice spoke to all. Soy feo, no, eso es tanto. Eres como yo, somos el mismo proto, proto, proto friki genérico, gafas, barba, eh, macho blanco. Doesn't have to take responsibility for himself. Stanley is as awake right now as he's ever been in his life. Now, hearing the voice speak these words was quite a shock to Stanley. After all. He knew for certain, beyond a doubt, that this was in fact a dream. Did the voice not see him float and make the magical stars just a moment ago? How else would the voice explain all that? This voice was a part of himself too, surely, surely, if he could just... He would prove it. He would prove that he was in control, that this was a dream. So he closed his eyes gently, and he invited himself to wake up. Pero yo no tengo pelo. <laughs> he felt the cool weight of the blanket on his skin. The press of the mattress on his back. The fresh air of a world outside this one. Let me wake up, he thought to himself. I'm through with this dream. I wish it to be over. Let me go back to my job. Let me continue pushing the buttons. Please, it's all I want. I want my apartment and my wife and my job. All I want is my life exactly the way it's always been. 
My life is normal. I am normal. Everything will be fine. I am okay. Fuck. <laughs> Stanley began screaming. Please, someone, wake me up. My name is Stanley. I have a boss. I have an office. I am real. Please, just someone tell me I am real. I must be real. I must be. Can anyone hear my voice? Who am I? Who am I? And everything went black. Literalmente este final es el meme ese de... Eh, este es Joey. Joey This solo... is the story of a woman named Mariella. Mariella woke up on a day like any other. She arose, got dressed, gathered her belongings, and walked ah! to her place of work. But on this particular day, her walk was interrupted by the body of a man who had stumbled through town talking and screaming to himself, and then collapsed dead on the sidewalk. And although she she to 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 call for an ambulance, <laughs> for just a few brief moments, she considered the strange man. He was obviously crazy, this much she knew. Everyone knows what crazy people look like. And in that moment, she thought to herself how lucky she was to be normal. I am sane. I am in control of my mind. I know what is real and what isn't. It was comforting to think this. And in a certain <laughs> way, seeing this man made her feel better. <laughs> yeah, then she remembered the meeting she had scheduled for that day. The very important people whose impressions of her would affect her career. And by extension, the rest of her life. She had no time for this, so it was only a moment that she stood there, staring down at the body. And then she turned and ran. Bueno, vale. Pues mira, mira Caco lo que estoy haciendo. Este es el Excel de los finales. <laughs> estoy haciendo los finales. Vale, escalera abajo. Esto es un final nuevo. Y aquí... Cuestionar existencia. A llamar bucle. Vale. Eh, ahora hay que quedarse encerrado en el cuarto de la escoba antes de meterse en el mundo de la puerta de la derecha. Le llama Excel, pero es un pein de mierda. Soy idiota. No sé por qué lo llamo Excel. El soft wind blew outside and perhaps rain started. And if it did, it stopped shortly after. Stanley hoped that he would one day see weather. Lo llamo Excel, pero eso es un pein. Sí, es verdad. Soy, soy idiota. No sé. Pienso en un. Estoy. Trabajo con Excel todos los días. Literalmente todos los días de la semana abro Excel. Y pein pocas veces. Lo tengo en la cabeza. Pido perdón. Que es el este, línea de cada matriz de cuadros en mi pupila azul. <risa> Yo siempre he intentado abrir las puertas, nunca se abren. Izquierda. Doors, doors Suponiendo de que el cuarto de las escobas sea algo, si no es nada, pues reiniciamos. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Hoping he might find. Oh no! Oh no! 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 Not again! I won't be part of this. I'm not going to encourage you. I'm not going to say anything at all. I'm just going to be patient and wait for you to finish whatever it is you enjoy doing so much in this room. Please take your time. Vale. Puedo. ¿Cuánto tiempo creéis que es lo que debo esperar? ¿Puedo actualizar un poquito de, de umbral? ¡Hostia, Charlie! En la foto esa... Qué guay. No va a pasar nada, ¿verdad? Bueno, supongamos que no va a pasar nada. 
Si que si crees que es algo realmente una interpretación de la temporada pasada. Creo que es un rato largo. Si es que es algo realmente y no una meta referencia en la línea temporal. No, es una referencia en la línea temporal pasada. En una línea temporal pasada entré, o sea, entré aquí y te dijo, no sé qué haces en el cuarto de escobas. No, no parece que vaya a cambiar nada. O sea, el juego tiene meta roll, pero. Pero hay cierto punto. Vale, entonces todos esos finales ya los hemos visto. Vale. Eh, cuarto de las escobas. Eh, nada Vamos a meter Que esto nos devuelve aquí De hecho, para aclarar Aclarar que el ascensor O sea, que la puerta derecha del jefe El ascensor nos devuelve aquí O sea, que no es nada Lo voy a hacer mejor A ver, lo vamos a hacer mejor. Estoy en ello, ¿eh? No. Ok. Vale, eh, lo siguiente es... Ahora sí, para el gusto de Brick, la puerta de la derecha. Aún no he ido por la puerta de la derecha, ¿no? ¿Cómo long was I sitting there? Stanley wondered to himself. Minutes? Days? Centuries? Did something crucial? Ahora voy por ahí por la puerta de la derecha por primera vez. He made a note to be more careful with time from now on. Siempre he ido por la izquierda porque quería sacar todos los finales de la izquierda. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, Ahora toca he entered the door on his left. Está, entiendo que el juego está hecho para que primero desobedezcas aquí. Porque me, me he metido... This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. El juego quiere que esta sea la primera vez que desobedeces. Pero bueno, yo he ido de otro lado. Oh, uh, yes, truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all, just to spend a few moments here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it all in. <laughs> Padre número uno, madre número uno, no se lo pone ahí. Yes, really, really worth it being here in the room. A room so utterly captivating that even though all your co-workers have mysteriously vanished, here you sit looking at these chairs and some paintings. Oye, eh, pues yo quiero una sala. Yo quiero una sala de empleados, tío. Nosotros no tenemos una sala de empleados. Tenemos un comedor y tal, pero. At this point, Stanley's obsession with this room bordered on creepy and reflected poorly on his overall personality. It's possible that this is why everyone left. A ver, me va a quedar hasta que se cabre. ¿eh? Stanley sat around waiting for more dialogue, but when a long time had passed and there was no more, he decided that the game was trying to send him a message. <laughs> a ver. Podemos aguantar, ¿eh? Qué joldear con cojones. Veinte, diecinueve, dieciocho, diecisiete, dieciséis, quince, catorce, trece, doce, once, diez, nueve, ocho, siete, seis, cinco, cuatro, tres, dos, uno, cero. Los finales de inactividad tienen que ser muy puntuales, porque si no. But at last he'd had enough of the amazing room and took the first open door on his left to get back to business. Vale, primero a la izquierda para volver. Vale, esto es mantenimiento. Y aquello me llevará a, a la inicial. Vale. Entonces el camino este tiene muchas. Tiene. Esto es una línea temporal aparte. Vale. Vamos a, a agrandarla un poco por aquí. Vale. Puerta derecha. Eh, ascensor, veo por ahí. Y luego está esto, vamos a hacer esto. El arquitecto. 
Stanley was oui. so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. No mientas, si estás, si estás mintiendo para ahora. Para. <risa> vale. Eh, ascensor, arquitecto. Vamos a ir al arquitecto. Le llama así porque es una referencia fácilmente localizable. Pero toda tarjeta. Lo puedo tirar. Ah. But in his eagerness to prove that he is in control of the story and no one gets to tell him what to do, Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged to his death. Good job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. Vale. <risa> uh, ha vuelto a cambiar el, el, el layout. Vale, vamos a apuntar suicidio. Arquitecto. Y aquí bajamos un momento. X roja. Se sabe incumple mucho la matía regola la lograr el EA6. Sí, sí. <risa> Por supuesto. Eh, suicidio. Vale. Vas a volver a ir al arquitecto y seguir para adelante. Porque me da miedo que cambie esto, tío. Ah, directamente aquí. When Stanley came to a set of two open derecha. doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Vale. Wow. Yes. <laughs> this room. What a beautiful room. What a gorgeous, gorgeous room. <laughs> Thank goodness Stanley had taken this detour on his way to the meeting room. Life without having experienced this room <laughs> was now too horrible. <laughs> Stop <even fell>. to <laughs> consider. Está muy enfadado, eh. Con esta sala no le gusta. Yes, really, really worth it being here in the room. A room so utterly captivating. Ah, esto, esto es lo mismo, esto es lo mismo. Los coworkers have mysteriously vanished. Here you sit looking, but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Lo he hecho con. Ya lo repé, sí, 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 era repé, era repé. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. El punto es encontrar todos los diálogos. Y cuando hay repes. Eh, vale, entonces, aquí te suicidas. No saltes del cargo cuando se está moviendo. Te causará la muerte. <risa> y, te car y te cargan. Eh. 6000. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you. Se puede saltar. All this time. What? Really? I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Why, I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you, to show you something beautiful. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. Vale. Entonces, a ver, esto es complicado. Suicidio está claro. Luego. Eh, vale, vamos a, hemos, vamos a decir que hemos ido por aquí. Ascensor no hemos ido. Aquí, saltar del montacargas. Vale, suponiendo que eh, la correcta es eh, continuar en el montacargas. Vale. Danger, danger everywhere. 2B1, eh. No packets past this point. Jolín, chaval, con los mensajitos, eh. Now listen carefully, this is important. Stanley walked through the red door. <risa> vale. Uh... <risa> Uh, va a haber que hacer esto más grande. Vamos a empezar. Vamos a hacerlo así. Vale, porque por aquí abajo está todo hecho ya. Vale, saltar del montacargas. Nos divide en dos. Que es... 
Eh, no, espera, lo vamos a hacer así. Bueno, nos divide en la principal, que va a ser... Venga, vas a decir que es la roja. Y una secundaria, que es la azul. Así por la roja primero. Está cartografiar el Eye of the Beholder y esto. Usan este colores para hacer hueco. Ah, no. De momento está bien. Está claro. Oh, ¿puedo ir por aquí? Te ahorras el texto. Nah, da igual. Prefiero escribirlo. Oh, thank God you are willing to listen to me. Do you see that I really have wanted you to be happy all this time? The problem is all these choices. The two of us always trying to get somewhere that isn't oh, here. Running and running and running just the way you're doing right now. Don't you see that it's killing us, Stanley? I just... I wanted to stop. I would... We would both be so much happier if we just stopped. And I think... Well, I think I have a solution. Here, let me show you. Se puede ir por otro lado. Ambas puertas iban al mismo sitio, ¿verdad? Hmm. What do we want? What are we looking for? Hmm. Here. Yes. Oh, it's beautiful, isn't it? If we just stay right here, right in this moment with this place, El final Stanley, zen. I think I feel happy. I actually feel happy. <laughs> oh. Oh. Y está haciendo el final de fumarse un porro, colorines. Mira, voy a hacer una cosa que Caco va a entender. Estoy de los chistes de drogas hasta los mismísimos cojones. Y va de verdad. El otro día hice una partida de umbral en la que eh, el conocimiento de un sitio se guardaba en incienso. Y claro, uno tenía que cruzar los, en los pasillos para oler el incienso y en sus recuerdos aparecía la información. ¿Qué pasa? Que estaba todo el chat diciendo ¡Eh, tronco, pásame ese porro! Así que todo el ácido chiste de drogas. Estoy de ver algo raro y que alguien diga ¡Oh, chiste de drogas! Estoy de eso hasta los cojonas. Pero de verdad... No por ti, bigotillos, no te preocupes. No te estoy echando la bronca. Pero quería, pero quería hacer un statement. Estoy hasta los verdaderos cojones de chiste. Es que no hace gracia, pero cero gracia. O sea, le da la vuelta. El primero es... Es lo de, ja, ah, no es gracioso. Luego, ajá, ah, es gracioso porque no debería ser gracioso. No es gracioso. Ha vuelto, da la vuelta. No es gracioso. No es gracioso. Si ves algo raro, enseguida tienes que meter las drogas. Tío, por favor. Qué, qué sencille, de verdad, qué simplificación. Qué horror. Lo de la partida me molestó, de verdad. Lo tuve que decir por el chat. Deja de hacer este chiste porque me está, me está estropeando la experiencia que trato de transmitir. No os cerréis a que cuando pasa algo raro tenéis que salir, coger la, la vía fácil, ¿no? La vía segura de las drogas, la vía de... No estoy cómodo con esto que está pasando, tengo que salir a las drogas, ¿no? Porque, ah, al pasar alucinando... No, las drogas son malas. Para empezar, fuera las bromas, las drogas matan gente. Dicho eso, odio ese chiste con toda mi alma. No lo soporto. Y me molestó en aquella partida. No, wait. Where are you going? Ah, ¿me puedo quedar aquí? ¿Quieres que me...? Right. Y es que me quede simplemente disfrutando de... <risa> no quiere que me vaya. Ay, pobrecito. Vale, va. Ojalá no haga un chiste de drogas. Tú no tienes... Tú, oh, no. Brick... Stay away from those stairs. If you hurt yourself, if you die, the game will reset. Sé, Brick, we'll lose all of this. Sé, Brick, que a ti te encanta enseguida meter drogas Please, en los sitios. No, Stanley, let me stay here. Don't take this from me. Please, Stanley, think about what you're doing. Oh. Sé que a ti, Brick, te encanta meter drogas en todos lados. Yo lo odio. De verdad, lo odio. Y no va en broma lo que voy a decir. Me molestó, de verdad. 
cuando me metiste el basilio como un fumeta. Me molestó, de verdad. Cuando metiste a Basilio como un fumeta. Me molestó, de verdad. No dije nada. Debería, pero no dije nada. Eh... ¿Qué se cae? Ah, sobrevivió. Thank God, you lived. You had me worried. No, no, no. What are you doing, Stanley? Please, I'm asking you not to take this away from me. I can't go back to what I was before. Se había tomado algo. Break. We'll both go back. Why are you doing this? Los dos supimos lo que hiciste con 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 el Basilio. Stanley, let's go back to the other room. Can you do that for me? My God. Is this really how much you dislike my game? Pobrecito. But you'll throw yourself from this platform over and over. Bueno, se acabó el tema. Vamos a seguir jugando el juego. Are willing to kill yourself to keep me from being happy? Am I reading? Es alquimista. ¿Qué quieres? No tiene ningún sentido. Yo soy químico y no hago, no hago metanfetamina. Well, maybe you're just getting a kick out of it. I don't know anymore. Cogiendo el aro de cuidación de cuatro cosas simplemente por mirar una escalera. Qué duro, eh. Me goodbye, Stanley. Is it over? It's going to restart, isn't it? I'm going back. Pobrecito, él también vuelve. Aunque él recuerda. O sea, el narrador recuerda cosas. Porque siempre, siempre recuerda. Siempre recuerda. Esto es verdaderamente saico, pobrecito. Toda esa experiencia depende de que está en este país escuchando y está diciendo que que va a terminarla. <risa> eh, hemos elegido la roja, ¿no? Vale, momento zen. Entiendo que este es el final zen. Vale, la pregunta es... Puedo... Eh, lo escribe en azul. Las preguntas van en azul. ¿Puedo salir? ¿Puedo no suicidarme? Vale, las, los azules son para investigar. Más adelante. Vale. Es una... Ah, vale, pensaba que había abierto una puerta. ¡Ole! Le Grab se va a hacer nuevo personaje. ¡Uh! ¡Qué ganas tenía de volver a jugar con él! ¡Ay, qué guay! Le Grab tiene nuevo personaje. ¡Qué chachi! ¡Oh! Le he cerrado yo. New content. <risa> Hostia. Te checaste mi proyecto de YouTube de Yogur. Sí, lo leí. Me gustó bastante. Pero lo tenemos que mirar. Por cositas, lo que comentamos. Además, como tú ya sabes, y que quede entre tú y yo, no soy yo el que te va a decir que no. <risa> eh, hay un new, no, no content. A ver. <risa> new content, directamente, eh. Esto ha sido antes de la puerta de la derecha, siquiera. Vale, pues nos vamos a ir hacia abajo. Nos vamos a ir hacia abajo. Antes siquiera de elegir la puerta derecha. Tenemos aquí... Espera, un poco para ahí. Vamos a llamarlo. He hecho esto... Espera, a ver, a hacerlo bien. A ver, maestre del paint. Esto lo vamos a mover aquí. A ver, estoy creando, ¿eh? A ver, por favor. Me estoy poniendo nervioso. Ahí. Y aquí vamos a bajar a nuevo contenido. Pero aún no vamos a ir. Primero quiero ver el contenido base. O sea, hay que volver al arquitecto, montacargas y luego la azul. Vale, y esto ya lo veremos en otro momento. 
Si cruzas esa puerta se ven muchas horas de contenido, solo digo eso. Ruta absolutamente nueva, el paint se está quedando escueto. Se ha sacado When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first. Llevo muchos años sin abrirlo. No creo que lo tenga instalado. The lounge was sublime, a work of art. What was it about this room that called so deeply and so personally to Stanley? Dice algo distinto cada vez. Its grace, its subtle charm. No, Stanley knew it was something deeper. Something darker. Así está que se repita el diálogo. Yes. Ya está esto. Really, really worth it being este here in the room. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Aún no hemos ido ni por aquí, eh. Este es el camino principal. Stanley was so bad at following directions. It's incredible he wasn't found. Vale, ahora ahí, luego ahí. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot. Ahora, la, la azul, hay que ir por la azul. I realize that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact that the stock is eager to prove that he is in control of the stock. Mierda, soy idiota. No, 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 no
Would you say that the game benefited from allowing you more choices? Da igual por cual te metas. Feel free to be honest. I'm looking for some real critical feedback here. Oh, of course. A three. Really. Maybe next time we can get you to form an actual opinion, you know? Any level of critical thinking or engagement with your surroundings? Does that sound good? Se enfada, eh? Do that? Yes? Mm, wonderful. Here, based on the data from your previous playthrough, I've compiled a new version. And to be perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. Let's take a look. Hostia. Hostia. ¿Eso es de verdad? Only the worst the first of players choose the blue door. Stanley's online. You are objective ranked 932 worldwide. Ah, del tiempo. <laughs> Porque no preguntas a unos amigos. Oh, amigos está vacío. Now, would you say that competitive leaderboard helped you feel motivated to keep walking through doors? Again, honest answers, please. Hey, I nearly forgot. I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on, and now would be a lovely opportunity to give it some playtesting. You wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? Perfect. Let me boot it up. Ha, y lo carga. In this game, the baby crawls left towards danger. What? You click the button to move him back to the right, and if he reaches the fire, you fail. It's a very meaningful game, all about the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the demands of family life. I think the art world will really take notice. Qué mierda! Of course, the message of the game only becomes clear once you've been playing it for about four hours. So why don't you give it four hours of play to make sure it's effective? Be sure to keep notes on your experience. ¿En serio? Es... Es horrible. Podría... No po vale, podría colocar un autoclicker. <ríe> que tengo instalado un autoclicker. Hay un plus a las dos horas. ¿Vas en serio que pasan cosas si paso dos horas haciendo esto? ¿Es en serio? ¿Va en ¿No va en broma? ¿En serio? ¿Pasan cosas si estoy dos horas haciendo...? No lo voy a hacer. Pero... ¿Sí? Dos horas. Hay un video en YouTube, luego lo miraré. De hecho, lo vas a ver ya. <risa> Quiero verlo. Eh... Vamos a verlo, va. Calla. Eh... Stan Lay Parable eh... Baby Ending for Hours. Stan Lay Parable Baby Game Ending. Pero son, pero son horas de verdad. ¿Esto va en serio, tío? Espera, creo que no tengo una captura de pantalla. Bueno, la puedo añadir. Hey, I'm the confront who give it later. Listen. Ah, this puppy is being umph. What is it? I thought to myself. Ah, vale, 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 vale. A ver. Eh, captura de ventana. Aquí, la voy a recortar un poco para que no se vean mis movidas. Estoy en ello, ¿eh? Soy maestro de los overlays, pero tengo un cierto... Vale. Eh... Vale. 
Creo que había un easter egg de clicar con Windows desde una puerta en concreto. He votado en dirección. Voto en ver el vídeo en directo. Así. Venga, a ver. Eh. Hey, I nearly forgot. I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on, and now would be a lag to the right. And if he reaches the fire, you fail. It's a very meaning. He think the oh, why don't you get Vale, dos horas después. Good to see that enthusiasm. Keep it up, Stanley. Just three hours and 15 minutes lleva. left to go. 15 minutes lleva. Okay, so clearly you're in it for the long haul. Although I find it hard not to believe you're simply running a program to click the button over and over, <laughs> which kind of ruins the point of the game, don't you think? Wouldn't that take the art out of it? You can tell me in your post play test analysis. Just popping in to say hi. I hope you weren't expecting more regular intervals of commentary from me, but that's not why you're here, is it? You're here for the game, for the art. For the endlessly spiraling sense of pointlessness and despair. Yes, this is what drives your every action. Keep clicking that button. For hope, for freedom, for science, for love. Don't ever, ever... No quieres que me hagas tu colección de pies. <laughs> me has pillado. You know, I've been spending the last two hours here embroiled in thought. And it's occurred to me, this game is incomplete. It's missing something. It still doesn't have that oomph. What is it, I thought to myself? What could possibly be missing from this incredible experience? And then in a moment of rapture, as though delivered by angels, it came to me. Before this moment, I was blind. Porque se ve tan mal. Those days are behind us. I now understand the true manifestation of this game. It needs a puppy. A puppy. ¿Qué dices? That's right. This puppy is being lowered toward an aquarium filled with nothing but piranha. Now you have to click the second button to avert the puppy's death. Wow! The babies. This is it, Stanley. Art. I did it. Video games are art. Ah, oh, but you have a good two hours or so to go, so I'll, I'll just let you get to that. No time to waste when there is such a meaningful game to be played. Wow! Bon chance, mon ami. Wow! I guess that dos horas haciendo esto. The is still alive. It warms my heart to see how deeply the message of this game has resonated Mira, with el tío optimiza, optimizado el camino. The joy welling up in your chest. The sheer joy of Es un programa, tiene puesto un programa. Que hace estos movimientos. It must be amazing. Tiene puesto un programa. I am no seriously. I'm deeply envious of your position at this very moment. ¿Cómo haces un programa que haga esto, tío? No lo puedes programar en el tiempo en el que pasa. Ah. The joy of artistic expression must be even stronger now. Drink it in, Stanley. Few people on this planet will ever get such an experience. Peer through space and time. The universe unravels itself at your Pausa el juego y un bot. Es verdad, puedes pausar el juego. Meaning of life. I know we said this would go on for four hours, but what if you never stopped? Think about it. You could just keep going. the world yeah. to see the man who never stopped pushing the buttons. You would be famous. Hay para para farmear cosas en el wow. To be famous. Wow de that in the surging power of artistic beauty to flow through you for all of eternity. You could have both of these things. We'll talk about it when you get there. Ah, vale. Yo estaba preguntando qué coño era hermología. Have we really been doing this for over three and a half hours? Goodness, how time flies. Wouldn't you say it's flown? Oh no, you, you don't have to answer that. I understand you're quite busy. Just just keep at it. Almost there. Oh. Nearly there, Stanley. Art itself is about to burrow into your skull. Aren't you excited for spiritual immortality? For transcendence and oneness with the beauty and essence of all beings, just a few seconds now. Here. Recordemos que el wow es lo único que hace que que Blizzard no deje de existir. Wow. Fear me, mortal. I am the essence of divine art. Be not afraid. Ah, no, I just be. 
Others but you cannot read this. <laughs> oh, others but you cannot read this text. <laughs> know that when you die, I'll personally carry your spirit across a very blocks into my garden, built within the motions of a flower. Me mía el contenido, eh. Literalmente es, es un ángel, eh. Vino Tafrey. There will be life together. We will dance and eat and sing. Would you like you will to improve comedy by some suggestion from me from our eternity? Aquí dijeron, este final solo puede ser para los verdaderos <risa> valientes. Bíblica la Coreida, Stanley. This is your reward for your work here today. <risa> Cuatro horas. Los True Gamers están aquí. <risa> Now, live your normal human existence. With me, light that follows this. This one. I love you. <risa> Qué pena ¿no? que nunca vaya a ver este final en mi ordenador. Perfecto. Y se acaba. Chachi. <ríe> um... <ríe> vale. Eh, eh, fuera. Vale. Eh, a ver, esto es Solo para Ahora tú <risa> Solo para dejarlo en constancia Esto es azul Laberinto donde dejas para el mal No, entiendo, <risa> claro, entiendo que ese es el final lógico No el que espera que haga Entiendo que aquí tenemos eh, El final rojo Lo voy a marcar como en verde Porque aún no lo he hecho Y no lo voy a hacer nunca Pero para distinguirlo Que se llama Juego 4 horas de bebé. Vamos a llamar así. 4 horas de bebé. Y ahora por aquí es bebé se quema. Bebé quema, para abreviar. Es el bebé el que quema. ¡Ah! Pain. Eh, 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 a las 5 lo tienes listo Es que a las 5 tengo partida Justo a las 5 O sea que Bueno, te quemas You heartless bastard Did you do it because you hate babies Or purely to spite me Because if it's the latter Well I don't know what to do I'm completely out of ideas I can't think of a single thing That might improve the experience for me I'm not even going to try I'm out I'm out, I'm done. It's over. Thank you for playing. Your input was extremely valuable. Oh, hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game? Just to ease the pain. Let's see. Flappy Bird. Ojo, eh. Estaba en auge en aquel momento. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. This seems like it'll work. Let's give it a shot. Flappy Bird estaba en auge en aquel momento. Oh no! Ah, fascinating. What do you think this game is about, Stanley? What's our backstory? What is our motivation? Mm -hmm. ah! Well, it seems obvious to me that you're ah! a creepy man spying on innocent civilians below you from up high in your creep tower. Juega real. Some sort of twisted. Juega real. Hmm. Yes, that must be it. What a fascinating venture into the ha cambiado, no sé qué tú crees que es. Depravity. So far, I love everything about this game, Stanley, and it seems there's even more. Come, let's venture outward and see what else is out there. Juega real, tú el el ¿Cómo se llamaba? Esto es nuevo, no era este juego, era otro. Tío, ¿cómo se llama este juego? Este es el el Firewatch. Oh, qué juegazo. Tío. <risa> este es el verdadero umbral, eh. Este es el verdadero umbral. Pues este juego es un juegazo, tío. Es buenísimo. Me lo pasé en directo también. Oh, no. No, 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 no. It can't be. ¿Es el juego entero? Aquí había un mapa. <risa> este juego había un mapa. It is. It's an open world game. Good God, quickly block it off. Ah! <laughs> oh, thank goodness, Stanley. What a close call. 
You nearly wandered off into that that thing, <laughs> that big open, just wandering around, no right or wrong direction. Por favor. No path to follow. You can just go in any. Oh, oh, oh thank heavens! <laughs> eh, se puede. It. We're out of the woods now, Stanley. No. Okay, I'm going to get us out of here. No Let's find another game, preferably something with walls, something with nice, big, insurmountable walls. Eso será un añadido. <laughs> Va a meter otro. Okay. I think this will be just the thing. Qué guapo, tío. Qué guapo. Oh no. Oh no. See, this is exactly what I had in mind. Oh no. Just a nice big box no. thing to run around in. There isn't any possibility that no. you could get lost here. Now this <laughs> is game design. 2013. So, if you manage to get lost in this game, I will be phenomenally impressed. No. Okay, so what exactly do we do here? Va a aparecer una pelota. There are lots of cars here in the back, but obviously there's no race track. Okay, I'm seeing that there's a ball of some kind back here. Is this game sports ball? Este juego no es ahora. I think it's sports ball. Oh, what fun. Free to play? We shall run the bases and do a touchdown together. Yes, I think surely we must. Una pelota o algo, okay, ¿no? Stanley, here's the ball. Have fun. Que está ahí de verdad todo este super. Oye, que voy a darme muy rápido, eh. Ojo. Boom, boom, qué marco, ojo, eh, qué marco, qué marco, va a explotar, eh. Are you doing it? Are you winning? Is this fun? Are you Is winning, son? Hold on, what are you doing? Are you winning, son? Stanley, don't do that. I can't follow you there. I can't help you. How will you write a story without me? You can't do it. You know that. Stanley, come back. Podría haberme quedado. Esto es otro final. Tendría que haberme quedado. Ay, la puta que me parió. Como ahora aparezca otro bicho, me cago. Un bicho me cago, eh. No tengo linterna, le he dado a la T. Oh. Ojalá aparezca en el primer Half Life. A ver si cada vez a tocar el paint. <risa> no. <risa> Pero hay otro final, mierda. <risa> Ah, 4.27 No hay nada Ah, vale, hay que seguir el camino I wonder what he found If what he wanted was to be the leading man in his own story, well, perhaps he's gotten it. Down in wherever he is right now. I wonder if he's happy with his choice. And if he's learned the heavy cost that comes with it. He'll understand soon what I was trying to tell him. He needs me. Someone who will wrap everything up at the end to make sense out of the chaos and the fear and the confusion. That's who I am. That is what I mean to this world. Oh, yes. Yes, I'll be back. There's no other way. Once this ends, after it all comes to a close, then I'll be back. The end will be here soon. Very soon. I can wait. Ha! A ver. Esto ha sido muy duro. Tenemos que analizarlo bien. El bebé se ha quemado. Nos hemos ido a eh, Rocket League. En Rocket League... Eh, Rocket League tenía... Caerse. Caerse. Era un final. Y ahora mi pregunta es... ¿Hay otro final aquí? ¿Hay un final que sea... 
Sí, pero Fire Watch no tiene... O sea, me refiero, es el final. En Fire Watch había más cosas para interactuar. No, no, no. En Fire Watch no había nada más para interactuar. La pregunta es... Si ahora voy a Rocket League y dejo que siga hablando, ¿encontraré más cosas? Va a haber que, va a haber que averiguarlo. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Ignorando la puerta de New Content muy fuerte. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Stanley felt lightheaded. Butterflies in his stomach. Es que oír lo que dice cada vez que estás aquí. Was it this room? A connection between the two? Y todavía no intenté insistentemente abrir alguna puerta. No. Love a room? I mean, truly, truly, deeply, madly, love. Yes, vale. really. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. No será esta, pero vaya. Déjalo, déjalo. <laughs> ya me dirás cuál, no te preocupes. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. What? Really? I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Why? I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you to show you something beautiful. Era el azul, ¿no? Sí. Let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. Now listen carefully. This is important. Stanley walked through the red door. Ah. Aha. Perhaps you misunderstood. Stanley walked through the red door. I still don't think we're communicating properly. All right, fine. Go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so badly what's out there? You want to find out what lies at the end of this road you've chosen? Well, don't let me stop you. You see? There's nothing here. I haven't even finished building this section of the map because you were never supposed to be here in the first place. Broken rooms, exposed developer textures. Is this what you had wanted? Was it worth ruining the entire story I had written out specifically for you? Do you not think I put a lot of time into that? Because I did. And in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable desires of yours. What would have made this game better? What did you want to see? Vehicles? Skill trees? Work with me. You've given me absolutely nothing so far. Tell you what. Let me take a stab in the dark at a new design and you can give me some feedback. There we go. A third option. This already feels leaps ahead of where we were before. Go ahead, Stanley. Take it for a spin. Okay, I'm going to stop you there. Now, tell me about your experience with this new version. Would you say that the game benefited from allowing you more choices? Feel free to be honest. I'm looking for some real critical feedback here. Aha! You see, I knew I was onto something. Where do these flashes of inspiration come from? How did I know the game needed a third door? Well, it's instinct mostly, a calling in your gut. I really couldn't say where the idea came from, except that I, I felt it in my soul. You can't teach that, Stanley. Don't even try. Here, based on the data from your previous playthrough, I've compiled a new version. And to be perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. Let's take a look. Nah, Now, would you say that competitive leaderboard helped you feel motivated to keep walking through doors? Again, honest answers, please. Hey, I nearly forgot. I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on, and now would be a lovely opportunity to give it some playtesting. You wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? Perfect. Let me boot it up. In this game, the baby crawls left towards danger. You click the button to move him back to the right. 
and if he reaches the fire, you fail. It's a very meaningful game, all about the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the demands of family life. I think the art world will really take notice. But of course, the message of the game only becomes clear this, yeah. once you've been playing it for about four hours. So why don't you give it four hours of play to make sure it's effective? Be sure to keep notes on your experience. Eso de las cuatro horas es verdad. You heartless bastard. Did you do it because you hate babies or purely to spite me? Because if it's the latter, well, I don't know what to do. I'm completely out of ideas. I can't think of a single thing that might improve the experience for me. I'm not even going to try. I'm out. I'm out. I'm done. It's over. Thank you for playing. Your input was extremely valuable. Oh, hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game? Just to ease the pain. Let's see. What do we have here? <coughs> yes. This seems like it'll work. Let's give it a shot. Están jugando a juegos de mesa, tremendo, eh? En umbral. Aha, fascinating. What do you think this game is about? Super, super dungeon explorer. What's our backstory? Es what is our motivation? Hmm. Hey, well, it seems obvious to me that you are meant to play as a creepy man spying on innocent civilians below you from up high in your creep tower, perhaps for some whipping. sort of twisted erotic purpose. Hmm. Yes, that must be it. What a fascinating venture into the experience Perdón. of total mental depravity. So far, I love everything about this game, Stanley. And it seems there's even more. Come, let's venture outward and see what else is out there. This is brutal, eh? I've put here the Firewatch. Tendrías que poder verte los pies. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Se asusta. It is. It's an open world game. Good God, quickly block it off. Uh, hey. oh. Thank goodness, Stanley. What a close call. You nearly wandered off into that... That thing. That big open... Just wandering around. Imagine that there were no ambientes of the game. Firewatch and Rogan didn't exist. Rogan didn't exist. In 2013, Rogan didn't exist. And what was there? Okay, I'm going to get us out of here. Let's find another game, preferably something with walls. What was there? What was there? Do you know? In plan. What was there in? What was there in 2000? What was there when this game came out? I think this. 2013, güey. No voy a decir nada, pues si te llamas adelante. Vale, vale, pues no lo digáis aún. A lo mejor después de este sale. No me voy a caer ahora. Me hace pensar que a lo mejor en Firewatch sí que hay una manera de llegar a un final, tío. Es que, guau. Hay tantos finales. Vamos a marcar ahora en azul, va. Ok, así que, ¿qué exactamente hacemos aquí? Vamos a ver. There are lots of cars here in the back, but obviously there's no race track. Okay, I'm seeing that there's a ball of some kind back here. Is this game well, sports ball? Sí, sí. Stanley, I think it's sports ball. Oh, what fun! We shall run the races pelota? and do a touchdown together. Yes, I think surely we must. Okay, Stanley. Here's es mola porque es un es un boomer el el narrador. Dice que ahora no me subí a la velocidad. Así. Are you doing it? Are you winning? Is this fun? Are you winning, son? Better than my miserable little story that I worked so hard on. Stanley, I have a thought, and I realize I'm not a sportsologist, but if one ball generates a certain amount of raw adrenal pleasure, then surely multiple balls makes for an even more euphoric sports experience. I'm going to try it out. Here comes another ball. Yes. Oh goodness, that really does feel amazing, doesn't it? Stanley, I'm like a child in a confectionery shop. I simply have to have more. I need to be special. More balls. Por favor. Are you enjoying this, Stanley? Are you having fun? 
Is this a real video? Esto es una referencia a Inside of Burnham. I hope you're having a good time because guess what? It's <laughs> you're over. having fun. That's ah. right. Your little fun comes to an end. This is my game, and what I say goes. You get to have fun when I let you, Stanley. Besides, you need someone like me to set boundaries for you. Without rules or boundaries, video games are nothing. Yes, that's what I am. I'm structure. I'm your sense of purpose. And since you decided you didn't want to play my game, now I don't want to play with you either. So, goodbye, Stanley. I'm leaving. See how you like it when I'm not around to set the rules. Somehow, I don't think you'll enjoy it as much. But who knows? You're an inventive kid. You'll come up with something. After all, you're the one who knows best. Take care, Stanley. Esto es lo que pasa cuando un director de tu campaña se enfada y tienes que jugar a rol solo. Esto es rol solo. Creo que no voy a tener que tirarme, eh. Estos anun este anuncio no salía de verdad en, <ríe> en Rocket League, ¿verdad? No parece que vaya a pasar nada. Ah, pensaba que esta era una caída. Está súper mal hecho, en realidad. <risa> También te digo. <risa> o sea, mal no, pero un poco he definido. Me tiro. Es que no hay otra. No parece que vaya a pasar nada más. Ah, pues estaba ahí. Stanley, don't do that. I can't follow you there. I can't help you. How will you write a story without me? You can't do it. Puedo ir a algún sitio que no sea caerme, porque aquí todo también parece que te tira otra vez. Sí, no, todo, todo es, todo es, todo es caída. No parece haber una manera segura de llegar a ningún sitio. Vale. Eh... Vamos a revisar nuestro paint. Entonces, el final de Rocket League es en realidad el final de caerse. O sea, son el mismo final. Porque es llegar hasta aquí. Una vez aquí no hay más decisión. ¿Vale? Entonces, por la puerta azul y por la puerta roja ya lo hemos tenido todo. Ahora hay que quedarse en el montacargas. Ahora hay que quedarse en el montacargas. Espera, esto lo vamos a poner aquí. Y aquí quedarse montacargas. Tengo hasta las dos más o menos. A las dos me marcho. Los lo que me dé tiempo y lo que no, pues en otro, en otro directo. El chat. Ahí. All of his coworkers were gone. What could it mean? Hay alguna puerta que activamente tenga que intentar abrir hasta que se abra. Alguna de estas que tiene salida. Esta. Por ahí hay una salida. Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference, nor did it advance the story in any way. Pero si la hay, pero da igual. Venga, va, dime cuál es. Va, no te enfades, dime cuál es. Sigue con tus pesquisas, Jolín, va, dime cuál es. Esta no. Dime cuál, va. Dime cuál, dime cuál. Esta. Trescientos y pico, wow. Al principio, ¿cómo va a ser trescientos? Si todas estas son cuatrocientos, cuatrocientos treinta, vale. Oh, please, are you really just doing this for the achievement? Click a door five times, is that all that you think an achievement is worth? No, no, no. I can't just give these merits away for such little effort. A measly five clicks. Now suppose you were to click the door 20 times. 
I would say that's the kind of effort that warrants recognition. Hmm. I have to say, I'm still not feeling the satisfaction of witnessing true effort for a noble cause. Perhaps 50 clicks will do it. Yes. Wow. Certainly, 50 clicks. No, no, I'm, I'm still not feeling it. I want this achievement to have meant something. It has to be a, a true reward for valiant effort. I want to see some hustle, Stanley. I want to see commitment, a willingness to go all the way, no matter what the cost. Why don't you go put 20 clicks ah, into la, door la. number 417? Ah! en la puta no, no, es la puerta no, ha dicho 417 veces no, no puerta 417 que no, que ha dicho que son 417 veces ¿cómo que no? es darle X veces a la... ah, ¿en serio? jolín, vale había Pero si yo, yo he leído que era es 417 veces. Vale, venga, a ver. Oh, great. Now, go click a few times ah, on vale. 437. Madre que me puto parió. Treinta y siete ahí. Excellent. I think we're getting somewhere. Now door 415. Let's give it 10 clicks or so. La 1-5. Now, back to door number 437. Madre que me parió. Me va a dar un logro y ya está, ¿verdad? Let's see. How about you click on, well, I don't know, the copy machine. ¿Dónde? All right. Back to room 417. I'm really feeling it now. I think we're getting somewhere. ¡Ah! Por favor. Okay, now go climb on employee 419's desk. ¿Cómo hago eso? Ah, con la caja. Vale. Yes, this is great. You're putting it all on the line, Stanley. I like that. All right, let's keep it up. Go give me a few clicks on door 416. ¿Dónde está esa? Eh, esa no está. 15 17 20 Ah, oh, eh, lo del input. Hay que encontrar qué ordenadores se encienden, mierda. Otra cosa para investigar. La 16, pero si no hay 16. Es un, es un tramas, no hay 16. Hay que ver qué ordenador, o sea, los, de vez en cuando algún ordenador random se enciende y hay que darle input. Vale, 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 vale. No hay 16. Puerta, new content. No. ¿Esta? 15. ¿Esta? No hay 16. 15 y 17. Oye. Es la que está entre la 15 y 17. Es la puerta de New Content, pero no me deja. Tiene que ser, pero no, pero no se oye nada. Es que no quiero entrar. Si, si entro se va a activar el New Content. A ver. Let's check a guide. Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe Door 416. Eh, 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 eh. Ah, es un bug. Ah, es un bug. Es un bug, es un bug, es un bug. Nada, 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 es un bug. Tienes que hacerlo antes. Es un bug, no no se puede. Este logo es el nuevo content, ya por supuesto, claro, pero no se puede. Vale, pues nada, bugazo. 
Eh, ya lo apañarán. <risa> Después podrás. Eh, vale, vamos al montacargas. Cuando avanzas a un encuentro, luego aporta los años montados. Luego podrá. Ah, vale. vale. Más tarde podrás. Bueno, eh, más tarde a lo mejor no apetece. Por dar vueltas por la, por la oficina. The lounge was grand, majestic, perhaps too majestic. ¿Cuántas frases hay para like esto? Like a combination of a much smaller version and a much larger version of this exact room. It all made Stanley uncomfortable, and he started to bleed a little. This made him smile. At last, proof that he was human. Me falta toda la ruta de la puerta de antes. Te subes si quitando contra una nueva para nada. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took sí, the no, first no, o sea... open door on his left. Aunque era toda esta ruta, ¿eh? Que ni, ni la he mirado. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't. Y el new content, el new content que a saber lo que es. Vale, ahora hay que seguir. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone you el new content es que son horas, bueno, ya está. Please, stop trying to make every decision by yourself. Now, I'm not asking for me, I'm asking for her. This is it, Stanley. Your chance to Jorge. redeem yourself. To put your work aside. To let her back into your life. She's been waiting. That's her, Stanley. You need to be the one to do this, to reach out to her. If you can truly place your faith in another, then pick up the phone. Oh, Stanley, is that you? Hold on, sweetie, sorry to keep you waiting. I'm just pulling the bread out of the oven. All right. Okay, there we go. All right now, I want you to come in and tell me all about your day. Ah! <laughs> gotcha. Oh, come on. Did you actually think you had a loving wife? Who'd want to commit their life to you? I'm trying to make a point here, Stanley. I'm trying to get you to see something. Come inside. Let me show you what you're doing here. Minutos. This is a very sad story about the death of a man named Stanley. Stanley is quite a boring fellow. He has a job that demands nothing of him, and every button that he pushes is a reminder of the inconsequential nature of his existence. Look at him there, pushing buttons, ¿Ah? doing exactly what he's told to do. Adiós, now he's pushing a button. Now he's eating lunch. Now he's going home. Now he's coming back to work. Que vaya bien el día. One might even feel sorry for him, except that he's chosen this life. P. But in his mind, I, ah, HP, in his mind frase. he can go on fantastic adventures. From behind his desk, Stanley dreamed of wild expeditions into the unknown, fantastic discoveries of new lands. It was no quiero mirar al maniquí. And each day that he returned to work was a reminder that none of it would ever happen to him. And so he began to fantasize oh. about his own job. First, he imagined that one day while at work, he stepped up from his desk to realize that all of his co-workers, his boss, Everyone in the building had suddenly vanished off the face of the earth. The thought excited him terribly. So he went further. He imagined that he came to two open doors and that he could go through either. At last, choice. It barely even mattered what lay behind each door. The mere thought that his decisions would mean something was almost too wonderful to behold. As he wandered through this fantasy world, he began to fill it with many possible paths and destinations. Down one path lay an enormous round room with monitors and mind controls. And down another was a yellow line that weaved in many directions. And down another was a game with a baby. And he called it 
the Stanley Parable. It was such a wonderful fantasy, and so in his head, he lived it again and then again. La línea, qué grande. Over and over. Será el montacargas. Es que estoy yendo en otro orden. Always feel this free. Surely there's an answer down some new path, mustn't there be? Perhaps if he played just one more time. But there is no answer. How could there possibly be? In reality, all he's doing is pushing the same buttons he always has. Nothing has changed. La línea de M oficial son los pas icónicos del juego. The more he gets, the more he forgets which life is the real one. And I'm trying to tell him this. That in this world he can never be anything but an observer. Que existencialista en realidad. A veces pasa, piensa que realmente le está hablando a Stanley, al concepto de Stanley que a, que a ti como jugador. Um. Vale. You see? Can he just not hear me? How can I tell him in a way that he'll understand that every second he remains here, he's electing to kill himself? How can I get him to see what I see? How can I make him look at himself? I suppose I can't, not in the way I want him to. But I don't make the rules. I simply play to my intended purpose, the same as Stanley. We're not so different, I suppose. I'll try once more to convey all this to him. I'm compelled to. I must. Perhaps, well, maybe this time he'll see. Maybe this time. And I tried again, and Stanley pushed a button. And I tried again, and Stanley pushed a button. And I try Qué duro. Vale. Eh... Vale, nada. Entonces montacargas es este final y ya está. Eh... Obedecer. Vamos a llamarlo ah, ah, apartamento. Ok. Esto ahí. Todo esto es un show de Truman. El narrador está intentando salvar a Stanley en un buque infinito donde al morir se convierte en el siguiente narrador. El próximo Stanley, el anterior narrador muere. <risa> Puede ser. Vale, uy, espera. Entonces, ahora lo que hay que hacer. ¡Ah! ¡Ya por fin! ¡Toca el ascensor! ¡Por fin, ascensor! Ay. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Y Pro puerta previa al arquitecto. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. And here it was, the lounge. What a room, Stanley thought to himself. What a room, what a room, what a room. This is what Stanley thought. What a room. What a room, what a room. Joder. What a room. A ver, es bonita. Va, va, boom. What a room. Ojalá tener esta sala. En plan, literalmente esta sala en mi puesto de trabajo. Sobre todo por la de veces que alguien se iba a pegar una tremenda hostia que por ahí. Eager to get back to business. Stanley took the first open door on his left. Dice Brick, aquí había otra alternativa. Había otra alternativa. Me he saltado algo. En la de antes. Mierda, no me ha dicho el qué. Dice Brick, ahí había otra alternativa. Bueno. And so he detoured through the maintenance section 
walked straight ahead to the opposite door and got back on track. Vale, esto nos lleva de nuevo al, al jefe. Activa la plataforma, pero da la vuelta. Ah, vale, vale. Jolín, va a volver luego. Bueno, de hecho, vamos a volver ya. Y así tenemos los caminos ya. Vale. Hay que revisar los ordenadores. Por el input. Hay que revisar los ordenadores porque uno de ellos puede tener lo de introducir input. Y ahí hacen falta tres inputs más. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Dios, vamos a escuchar una nueva. It was okay. <laughs> ya está. <risa> Estaba bien. Y ya está. Esta vez no ha habido más. Uy, no hay más. Yes. Vale. Really. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Ya se ha cansado el pobre. Está hasta los cojones de la sala de empleados, eh. Stanley was so bad at following directions. It's incredible. Deja ya, ya se ha dejado quitar. Esto es una paradoja. <risa> Hay un ordenador que se ilumina y dice esperando input y le das a, le das a clic y avanza una barrita y llevo dos de tres, dos de cinco, perdón. Se, se va haciendo a lo largo de los bucles. Yo conozco esa sala de si la plataforma de chat te ha dejado que se vaya. Ah, entonces, vale, vale, vale. Ah, te pillo ya. Ah, vale, pero no avanzar. Vale, vale, vale. This is it, Stanley. Your chance to redeem yourself. Entonces, aquí no hay nada más. Y ese teléfono a gente puedes no cogerlo. Ah, vale, puedo no cogerlo. Madre mía, sí que hay finales tú. That's her, Stanley. You need to be the one to do this. Oh, no, 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 you can't. Ah. Did you just unplug the phone? No, that wasn't supposed to be a choice. How did you do that? You actually chose incorrectly. I didn't even know that was possible. Let me double check. No, it's definitely here, clear as day. Stanley picks up the phone. He's taken to his apartment where he finds his wife, and the two pledge themselves to one another. Music comes in, fade to white, roll credits. Not picking up the phone is actually somehow an incorrect course of action. How is that even possible? None of these decisions were supposed to mean anything. I don't understand. How on earth are you making meaningful choices? What did you... Wait a second. Did I just see... No, that's not possible. I can't believe it. How had I not noticed it sooner? You're not Stanley. You're a real person. Ah! <sighs> I can't believe I was so mistaken. This is why you've been able to make correct and incorrect choices. Esta es la primera and vez. And you run around in this game for so long. If you've made any more wrong choices, you might have negated it entirely. It's as though you completely ignored even the most basic safety protocol for real world decisions. Esta es la primera vez que el narrador sabe que soy un jugador. Well, I won't have that kind of risk on my watch. I'm going to stop the game for a moment so we can educate you properly on safe decision making in the real world. Please observe this helpful instructional video. Wow. Choice. It's the best part of being a real person. But if used incorrectly, it can also be the most dangerous. For example, in this scenario, a hypothetical real person named Rupert has a choice. He could invent a machine that eliminates food shortages across the world to make life better for all people. Or he could spend years of hard work forgetting how to read. Which choice would you make? Remember that unlike here, the real world <laughs> makes sense. And at no time should you make a choice that does not conform to rational logic. If you find yourself speaking with a person who does not make sense, in all likelihood, that person is not real. Wow. Allow the person to finish their thought 
Then provide an excuse why you cannot continue talking. Turn to a partner and practice saying, my goodness, is it 4.30? I'm supposed to be having a back sack and crack. Yes. Excellent. Making choices on a regular basis is the best part to a healthy decision-making process. Most medical professionals recommend making <laughs> <choices> <laughs> <per> <laughs> <day>. <laughs> Do you make more than eight? Less? And finally, if you begin to wonder if your choices are actually meaningful and whether you'll ever make a significant contribution <laughs> no. to the world, <laughs> the just is no. remember that in the vast infiniteness of space, your thoughts and problems are materially insignificant, and the feeling should subside. At this time, your instructor will guide you in an exercise to test and reinforce the material covered in this video. Esta sí que es la filosofía que me gusta. Ah, welcome back. Ah. You may have noticed that this room has begun to deteriorate as a result of narrative contradiction. Contradicción narrativa. Way. Now that you're properly informed on good decision making, we're going to revisit a choice you made just a few minutes ago and see what the correct thing to do would have been. This way, please. Dios. Now that we know your choices are meaningful, we can't have you jumping off the platform and ah, dying. Me han puesto... Imagine the main character dying senselessly. Me han puesto la barra. The story. That story would make no sense at all. We just need to get you home as soon as possible before the narrative contradiction gets any worse. Unfortunately, it seems this place is not well equipped to deal with reality. there you'll take the door on the left back to the correct ending the story will have resolution once again and you'll be home free in the real world now remember all you need to do is behave exactly as Stanley would that means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first Dios aplicar esto al rol eh just follow my lead and you'll be fine all right <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Mierda! ¿Qué hago? <laughs> no lo sé. Te refieres a cuando el jugador no hace lo que quiere llevar a ese mismo punto. <laughs> Exacto. <laughs> Exacto. Literalmente, esta es una. No tengo pensado cómo convertir esta en una partida no confundida entre DM y personajes porque no jugadores. <laughs> No, no, esto tiene que hacerse con jugadores, no con DM. ¿Qué hago? ¿Por dónde voy? Mate un Pokémon con sus decisiones. ¿Quién es de la vida? ¿Aceptas? No, why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back in the other direction. Perhaps we're not too late. Vale, ya está. Se estropea un poco y ya está. Pero no puedo... O sea, si vuelvo a entrar no cambia nada, ¿no? Se, se, corro, se corrompe ya, se contradice. No, oh, it's ruined. No. Oh. I can't believe, after everything we talked about, that you... My story, you've destroyed my work. Why? For what? What did you get out of that? What did you think was so special about seeing the game undone? Left here like so much garbage. It, well, it's worthless now. And what am I supposed to do? Even if there were a way to continue, would it be worth it? To know that my story is now incorrect? How can I go back to that? I can't erase that knowledge. I'll have to live with it forever. Reliving its impossibility forever. I couldn't live that way. Is it better to shut the game down entirely? To willingly destroy all of my work? I don't know. What's the answer? What do I do? What do I do? What do I... No, I have to. I have to shut the game down. I have to. I have to. Pile of rubbish with you, you 
Literal, literal, GLaDOS y, y Chell, ¿eh? Son el análogo. If you'd just gone through the door on the left, you would have seen it. There was a whole underground facility. You would have destroyed it and been Hombre, victorious. Mira, it would have been so perfect. I worked so hard on it. I tried ah, so hard ves. to make... ...is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Literal, me ha asustado porque en el momento en que he baneado al, al bot. No, why did you do that? Quickly, hurry. Is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting. En el momento en el que he baneado al bot, se ha reiniciado. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <coughs> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back. Is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, He entered the door on his left. Vale. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's ah. office, hoping he might come into a staircase. Lo hemos apañado. Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Se ha arreglado. Stepping inside his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover a no cambiado. indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this until he saw the door with a voice receiver next to it. Surely behind this door lay all the answers to his questions. Esto, eh? And beyond all probability, he knew the passcode. He had seen it on his boss's computer just last week. Night Shark 115. Was this the code to open the door? Would it still work? There was only one way to find out. Stanley had been trained never to speak up, but now he would draw from within Hablar. himself the courage to face the unknown. He drew a sharp breath and then spoke the code. White Sar 155. Stanley spoke the code. Night. Night Shark 115. He spoke it into the receiver right there on the wall. Night Shark 115. A lo mejor me pilla el, el detector de voz. No creo, ¿no? I'm sorry, is there a problem? You didn't mishear me, did you? Please speak the code into the receiver. Otherwise we can't get on with the story. This is a crucial step. Habría sido un puntazo. Bueno, entiendo que la gracia es que no lo diga. Okay, fine. You're not gonna do it, but you know what? It's pretty humiliating to bring you this far, only for you to suddenly decide you have better things to do. I asked you for this one single thing for your respect. Pregunta. Esto es debido a lo de la corrupción o es otra cosa? If you didn't want to see what I had to show you, then why did you come here? You had a choice, you know. You could have gone through the door on the right. You could have done whatever the hell you wanted over there. Why did you come this way? Speak. Say something to me. Explain yourself, you coward. You... When Stanley came to a set of two ah! doors, he entered the door on his left. Stanley? Hello? Are you... Is everything okay? Stanley, please. I I need you to make a choice. 
I need you to walk through the door. Are you listening to me? Can you hear me? Is everything all right? Stanley, this is important. The story needs you. It needs you to make a decision. It cannot exist without you. Do you understand me? Whatever choice you make is just fine. They're both correct. You cannot be wrong here. We can work together. I'll accept whatever you do. I simply need you to take that step wow. forward, please. Choose. Do something. Anything. This is more important than you can ever know. I need this. The story needs it. So, you hear me? Are you there? Are you listening to this? Stanley, are you there? Okay. It's okay, I can wait. You need time to decide. Time to make sure your choice is correct. That is the best choice. That's all right. I'll wait for you to decide what's the right thing to do. Take as much time as you need. Entonces hay una cuarta fuerza entidad en esta experiencia, nada está el jugador y lo que sea que haya provocado que estemos viendo esto. Caco, le estás dando muchas más vueltas que yo. <risa> A ver, eh, esto ha sido... Ah, claro, esto ha sido desenchufar el teléfono. Eh... Aquí. Desenchufar. Y desenchufar nos ha llevado... A eh, the end. Voy a llamarle Ayuder. Por ejemplo. Vale. Eh, entonces, ahora está lo de subirse al montacarga e irse, ¿no? Vale. Voy a, hacer, voy a jugar un poquito más, pero no mucho más. Montacarga e irse. Vale, revisamos. A soft wind blew outside and perhaps rain started, and if it did, it stopped shortly after. Stanley hoped that he would one day see weather. Sigue como una tormenta fuera, eh, a veces. Vale, revisar los ordenadores. Check. Pasar del nuevo contenido. When Stanley eh, came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly La well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. It was okay. <laughs> ya no hice nada más. <laughs> Está bien y ya. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. No, pasamos. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Oh. oh well, look who's got cold feet. Sorry to break it to you, Stanley, but that lift isn't coming back. You'd best either get comfortable right here on this platform, or test your luck by jumping to the floor below. You know what? Looking at it now, it's not that far to the bottom floor. I bet you can make it. Game is with you, eh? Come on. I'm sure you'll survive the jump. Don't tell me you're scared. That's not the Stanley I know. Do it. 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 Qué cabrón, no quiero. No. Ah. No quiero. Don't. <laughs> no quiero. Parece que es lo que hay que hacer, ¿eh? Me la voy a pegar. No hay una manera de ir por algún lado. Caer en una caja. Whoops. Looks like I was wrong. How clumsy of me. Qué hijo de puta. <risa> vale. Eh, la vas a considerar la misma que tirarse. No vas a considerar la otra. Vale. Ya nos queda el ascensor solo y el nuevo contenido. El resto, en principio, lo hemos visto todo. A no ser que me haya dejado cosas, que es probable. Que, bueno, bueno eso lo, 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 lo miraré luego. Ascensor aquí. 
Arquitecto. Suicidio, donde te cargas, enchufar, ayudar. Que ayudar es corrupción también. Apartamento, bebé se quema. Vale, yo creo que hemos visto bastante. Y así que será en el próximo... Es una variante, pero la misma cosa. En el próximo lo terminaré, no sé, un día de estos. No creo que la semana que viene pueda. Y la, semana, y la siguiente tampoco. Ya veremos. Pero bueno, chicos. Eh, Caco, muchas gracias por haber estado aquí. Espero que te hayas pasado bien. Nos vemos pronto. Me voy a retirar. Un saludo a todos. Y hasta la próxima. Adiós.